when I start streaming, I always feel like I'm forgetting something. But I guess not. I got my hot drink. What more could I want? What more could I want besides hot drinks? Um, let's see. At notifications. Going live on Twitch right now. Hello. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Um... I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready and prepared today. I think so. Hello. Good morning, everybody. Just pinging the Discord right now. And we're good to go. All right. I made it. Fails to communicate with camera. What are you talking about, computer? I see myself. <laughs> Hello. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Today we're playing Strange Town. And I got to tell you guys, I, I had to revise my my number of children rules my population rules i had to revise them because we still have too many damn kids <laughs> oh thank you so much for the prime sub zaddy m thank you so much and thank you for the eight month eight month prime sub lie heart fox and the four month prime sub zaddy m thank you so much um thank you kira <laughs> i got this is my new summer shirt i got some new summer clothes uh, I did update it on the website, yes. Well, I updated, I updated the main post, but I haven't updated my actual game rules post yet because I ran out of time because I had to start streaming. So I'm going to do that after the stream, but I did update the post, uh, the limiting population post. So what I'm doing now is Sims can have between one and three children max. That's it. That's it. Nobody's having more than three kids anymore. It's too damn much. <laughs> so we're not going to have babies for a while, I think. Uh, thank you so much, Nikki. And uh, thank you so much for the 11 month prime sub, Kristen. Thank you. And thank you for the two month prime sub, Caitlin NK. Um, so, yeah, you guys can check it out. So, basically, what I did is Romance and Pleasure only gets one child, Knowledge, Fortune, and Popularity can have two children, and Family can have three. The only exception is. If a family sim has the lifetime want to marry off six children, then they can have six. That's it. That's it, though. That's what we're doing now. Because it's too damn much. It's too damn much. <laughs> uh, thank you so much, uh, Vigilanton, for 10 months at Tier 1. Thank you for the t brand new Tier 1 sub, Ruby Meow. Thank you very much. Damn it. When you feel you're slow, when I forgot to change the stream title again. Good God have mercy. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Why can't I remember to do this simple thing? <laughs> I don't know. I even have a checklist and I just ignore it. Um, okay, so this is not Sims 3, y'all. This is Sims 2. Okay, this is not. Let me let me change it. Sims 2 Strange Town Saturday. Once again, I forgot and I'm so sorry. I'm gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have to set like an alarm on my phone that says update stream title, Cindy. Uh, let's get strange today, y'all. Let's see the Sims 2. All right. I also did not update the, I was sitting here like two minutes before I was like, did I do everything? I think I did everything. I'm ready. I'm ready. And then I started the stream. I was like, I know I forgot something. <laughs> uh, thank you so much for giving out five gift subs, Altarius. Thank you so much uh, for giving out those gift subs to Holly Ivy Witch, Monica Christine, Ashley 1008, Rivzeki, Cryoslite. Thank you so much. Uh, oh, and thank you so much for the 12 months at tier one misquote. Yes, it's been a year. Can you believe it? Thank you so much for sticking with me for a year. I also got two beg for gift subs from Julius, Julius Niv and Bella B3LLA3S, if anybody feels generous. Okay, let me just update here our chat commands good god someday i'm gonna remember to do it i swear to you i swear to you someday i will <laughs> this is twice in a row uh we're gonna go stream info congratulations 
Congratulations, Cindy. You blew it. Uh, I have a little... I have on my stream checklist, I have a little thing I can copy. Cindy is playing Sims 2 Strange Town today. We're just going to copy that. We're going to post that, paste that over. We're going to save that. And now we're finally ready to play. All right. All right. So I was also working on my spreadsheet, my Strange Town spreadsheet this morning. I was walking, working on another blog post that I'm doing about The Sims 3. I was working on my Sims 3 world. Y'all, I got like a million projects going on right now, but it's all going to come together. It's all going to come together next week. <laughs> Thank you so much for the six month prime sub, Meyer Mel. Thank you so much, Mirror Mel. I'm hydrating with tea for you guys. I'm hydrating. Uh, thank you so much for the three month prime sub, H Zorik. It is Strange Town Saturday. Yes, it is. Um, so I'm going to just pull up Strange Town now. I've got my game loaded here, and we're getting ready. Everybody in your town's fortune or knowledge is secondary? I don't know. I guess just sometimes it, that's how it turns out. Uh, thank you so much for the 100 bits, Mr. Roboto. Thank you very much. Yeah, y'all, I'm really digging my hair, how my hair looks right now. Um, I have embraced the mullet and I actually love it now. I love my mullet. It's getting long in the back. It's getting long pretty soon. I'm gonna look like Joe Dirt. <laughs> I've inspired you to play Sims 2 again. That's awesome. You're 30 tomorrow, Zoe. Well, happy early birthday to you. And welcome to the be to your best decade, your 30s. I say that now when I'm in my 30s. When I hit my 40s, the best decade will be the 40s. <laughs> oh, this is your first Straight Town Saturday. I'm glad you could join us. And thank you so much for the 200 bits, Draculia. Okay, guys, let's head over to the game. And I don't even, give me a second. <laughs> there it is. I don't even know who we're playing. Are we still playing the Curious Brothers? Or the Curious Brothers? They're no longer the Curious Brothers. They all have their own house now. I can't remember if we finished the Curious House. Let's go in and find out. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. So I was looking at my spreadsheet and I was trying to figure out how many children everybody can have. Well, Pascal and Nervous are are done. No, I think they can have one more if they want. They can have one more. They can have up to three children because Nervous is a family sim. So they can have up to three and they currently have two. They have Tycho and they have Samuel, who we just found out in the last stream is going to be gay. So we have, I think he's our first gay <coughs> sim of this next generation. Um, let's see here. Thank you so much uh, for gifting a sub to Zoe Altarius. Thank you so much. Pascal and Nervous are so cute. I know. I know they are. Yeah, we will be playing Vidkin next. Um, I just got to go in here and make sure that we finished out their round. I think we did, but I can't remember. I didn't mark it off as finished, so that could just be me. You're starting an Uber hood. Good luck. Good luck. I have never done that. Uh, because there's just so many, there's so many households. And it's like, I want to start out small and get big as my, as my neighborhood grows. The Uber hood is just not for me. No, Tycho is not gay. Samuel is gay. Doo -doo -doo. Samuel subject. Samuel subject. <laughs> I didn't change his last name because I thought it sounded so good, Samuel Subject. Um, he's not a curious, he's a subject. Thank you so much for the 100 bits of Blue Crossbow. I got my tea, got my hot drinks. <laughs> well, thank you for listening, Snake. I like having big neighborhoods, too. Um, that's why I, I started doing four-day rotations. Right now in my Pleasant View that I'm doing on YouTube, I'm still on seven day rotations and I have to complete seven day rotations until I get through the round. Then I'm going to four. Then I'm going to four days. Four days is really the minimum that I can personally play. Um, okay, so Sam, uh, yes, and Samuel also wants to have his very first kiss and I have no idea who he's gonna have his very first kiss with. We might have to find him a townie or he might have to wait he might have to wait until he goes to college to get that first kiss. I feel so bad when that happens to my Sims. 
Um, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Lily Zolly, Chris Rich. Thank you so much. Can I make a video about creating townies? Um, I already did make a video about that. About how to create unique townies in The Sims 2. Yeah, I already, I already did. Um, okay, so let's see. What do we have going on here? One day. I think this is our last day. We actually have the, to finish out this last day. Um, and we're good. Who? Crystal Curious and Jenny Smith. They're wearing the same color. So Crystal Curious is pregnant with what is going to be their last child. Damn it. <laughs> I play Monday to Monday too in my Pleasant View, but my neighborhood has gotten so big that playing seven day rotations it just takes too long. So that's why I went to four. I'm going to be playing by season next next time. Uh, <laughs> you didn't have your first kiss till college. They can suck it up. Um, so yeah, we're going to be playing. No, wait, I'm not. Never mind. Wait, yes, I am playing by season here. I'm playing by season here, right? Yes. Okay, so we do have one day left. Once it turns to summer... Somebody tell me if I'm wrong. I think that's right. Um, once it turns to summer, we'll be moving on. So this is basically their last night. We don't have much going on. We'll just finish up their last night, and then we're going to move on to Vidkin. Uh, thank you so much for the 300 bits, Kaden. You just got a new laptop. All right. If there were only five mods I could keep in my, in my game, what would they be? In Sims 2? That's a tough one. Thank you so much for the two months in advance at tier one, Maddo, Mad Dog Maddie. It would definitely be. It would definitely be uh, ACR, Sim Blender, Monique's hacked computer. Those three are must haves for me. Um, I don't know what my other two would be. I have to think about it. I don't know what my other two would be. <laughs> uh, the UI mod would not be a must-have for me. I've even considered taking it out recently. Uh, camera mod, I don't count that as a mod because it doesn't, you don't really put it in your mods folder. So I don't really count that as a mod. Look at Pascal looking out the window. We're having a freaking birthday party right now. I think we're still having Samuel's birthday party, y'all. And he's over here doing his homework. Him and his brother. <laughs> uh, my aging mod would be number four. Yes, the aging mod. And what else? What would be number five? Oh, si uh, bat box. Yes, thank you, bat box. Yes, that'd be number five. If I had to choose five, that's what I'd choose. Those are the most important ones. Well, also, you need no unlink on delete. You need no unlink on delete. I'd probably choose that over an aging mod. Um, the party's a freaking roof racer. Roof racer over here. <laughs> Hype train complete. Your community contributed a total of 18 sub gifts and 800 bits. Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate that. Oh, there's little Dawn. Let's check in on everybody. I want to check on their needs. Pascal is having himself a piece of cake. We got our twin girls here, Gabby and Harper. They're so cute. I like her little headbands. It's adorable. <laughs> uh, it's on Pleasant Sims, Lumpukin. It should be on my Sims 2 playlist. I made it pretty recently. Should be on my front page. Um, oh my goodness. Hello. Hello, guys. <laughs> They're just making out at the party. Nothing to see here. Oh, look, he wants to classic dance with Nervous. Let's have a little classic dance at the party. Why not? Why not? Would you like to dance with me, my love? Who, me? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Get a room. <laughs> there they go. How sweet. Oh my god, he wants to woohoo. Okay, well, uh, no, I can't lock that in right now. You know what? Just go woohoo then. <laughs> Wait, Nervous is hungry first. Let him eat some cake. Let him eat some cake. And let's check in on Tycho, who also wants to have his first kiss, y'all. Okay, the great, uh, the birthday party rocks a great job, Roof Razor. That was great. So that was actually Samuel's birthday party. Oh my God, Samuel. Look at your, look at your needs. Look at your needs. 
uh, go to the bathroom and... Where is this his room over here? Okay, we gotta we gotta make his room look more like a teenage boy's room, don't we? He doesn't he no longer needs a toy box. And then we can change so he likes the color red. So we're gonna change his bedding to something more suitable. How about that? That looks good. That looks good. Can we change the color of this? That's better. Okay, the family doesn't have very much money, but at least he has his own room with his own bed. <laughs> so he's gonna go to the bathroom. He's gonna go get some sleep. And I'm gonna be shortly be sending everybody else to bed. Tycho has been a teen for a long time, yeah. Um, he actually becomes, he's gonna age up next round on our very first day. He's gonna either become a young adult or go to college, which he definitely keeps rolling the want for. So I really hope um, that we will get him in university next round. The design is awful. Someday we're going to fix it. Someday. I kind of did something over here, didn't I? Oh, yeah, I added another bathroom over here. Because they really needed it. Look at nervous <laughs> serenading Pascal. Okay, let's check in on these two. They're doing pretty okay. Let's have them go have a woohoo. Um, where's the casual menu? Casual woohoo in the bed, and then they can go to sleep after that. Good night, guys. Have fun. Have fun. <laughs> Tycho's jumping on the couch like the crazy maniac he is. All right, that's enough, Tycho. Dang, look at him doing those flips. <laughs> He's going crazy over there. All right, go use the bathroom. Enough playing. Go use the bathroom, and everybody go to bed. Everybody just go to bed for the night. It's 1030. It's a Monday night. It does look like a laboratory, and I think that's how it's supposed to look. Uh, thank you so much for the seven-month Prime Sub Luna Temple. Thank you so much. My mic keeps slipping down. I gotta figure out, I think something's wrong with the weight of it or something. I hope you guys can hear me okay. A second floor would be good. Yeah. I will do a renovation of their house as soon as they get enough money. <laughs> right now they only have 669 simoleons. So right now we're just kind of working on it slowly. Tycho, did you go all the way outside to go to your bedroom? Ugh. The number of doors in this house. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know what's up with the, the concrete outside. I don't know. We deleted some of it so we could bake a pond because Samuel's hobby is fishing. Uh, so Nervous and Pascal had a little pond put in for him. We're going to say that's his birthday present. That's his birthday present. <laughs> that's true. That's true. If you take all the uh, columns and platforms off the roof, it real it will give you a lot of money. That is true. And we could we could probably get rid of all these stupid columns and a whole bunch of this stuff to get money. And we could delete all this all this concrete out here too. That's a good point. Uh, maybe we'll do that sometime. But I gotta tell you, I'm kind of ready to move on to the next family. What's wrong, Nervous? Nervous, what are you doing? Are you gonna... Um... He's going to eat chips. He had a woohoo and he's going to eat chips. <laughs> if, if I bulldozed it completely, I definitely could make a better house. But I like to keep the structure. I like the idea that they bought an old laboratory to turn into their house. It just, it needs, it needs some help. The tile floor seems very uncomfortable to me. It seems very, like it would be very cold and sterile. <laughs> now you crave Pringles. I haven't had Pringles in a long time. They're pretty good though. That's his after woohoo snack, exactly. <laughs> I love Nervous, too. I love Nervous so much. He has, he's probably one of my favorite Sims in Strange Town, I gotta say. <laughs> you don't like how the UI shrinks? I don't mind. This is a good size for me. Um, in The Sims 3, I think it can be a bit small. But I like this. This is all right. 
Oh, are you going to take a bath now? Don't take a bath right now. Here, just use the bathroom and go get some sleep, Nervous. Let's just get some sleep, buddy. Yeah, I bet it's nice in the summer, but in the winter it's going to be cold. That's why I think we should get them some rugs. Can he not sleep for some reason? Okay, let's clear. Uh, let's clear the beds. Clear all. Now you should be able to sleep. There you go. I'm actually, I've actually been thinking about going back to the normal UI um, because sometimes when I play my any game starter um, and I have the old UI, I'm like, man, I love this old UI. <laughs> Why did I change? <laughs> uh, thank you so much for the five months at tier one, Kayla. But I also, I haven't been, I obviously, I haven't been bothered enough to do it. Did I get everybody? Yeah, thank you, Luna Temple, for seven month prime sub. If I didn't, thank you. And if I did, thank you again. <laughs> um, okay, and I gotta hydrate too. I like the clean UI. I like it. But sometimes I wanna change, you know. Um, all right, so it. Oh, 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 it's changed. It's changed to summer. All right, we're gonna save. We are done here. And we're moving on to Vidkin. Oh, thank you so much for the 40 bits, Kaden. Thank you so much. Let's go. Let's go out to the neighborhood. <laughs> UI means user interface. Okay. So also in Strange Town. We have the little, we have two little tiny houses over here. <laughs> we have Laszlo and Crystal live here with their two twins, Gabby and Harper. And then Vidkin lives here with his two alien daughters, Dawn and little Daniela. So we're gonna be playing Vidkin next. Now Vidkin has no money and they live in a literal shack. So it's gonna be, <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. Yes, a windowless shack nonetheless. Uh, thank you so much for the four month prime sub honey rose 830 and the six month prime sub shoddy. Thank you. So this is their, this is their shack and it's so tiny that even the kid's toy has to be outside because there's no room for it on the inside. This is what we've got going on in, on the inside. Um, let's put the walls down. So we've got room for everyone to sleep. We have a tiny bathroom and one tiny fridge and a counter and a phone. That's all. That's all we have here. <laughs> There's no, there is paint on the walls, just not on the outside. There's paint on the inside. Yes, taxes. Um, that's exactly, oh, we do need to do taxes. Dang it, I forgot. Okay, hold on. Let's go back out to the neighborhood because they're probably going to get a tax refund. No, I don't want to save. I didn't do anything. Good. I forgot about taxes. Thank you for reminding me. I also have coffee here. I have coffee and tea and water. I am all set for beverages. <laughs> okay, so there, the uh, net worth is 3,163. So I'm gonna round that to 3,100. And actually it would be 3,200. I'm gonna round it to 3,200. And then let me just get my rules here. And I'll let you guys see my calculator so you don't get too bored. <laughs> And for our finances, they are going to get 1,000 deduction for having two dependent children. We're going to get a 1,000 million deduction for home ownership. Oh, no, I'm sorry, not 3,200, 320. I hope, are you guys telling me that in the stream? Nobody, nobody caught it. Um, <laughs> It's 10% of net worth. I was like, how can he owe taxes? That makes no sense. Sorry, 320, not 3,200. Good God. Okay, so 1,000 simoleons uh, deduction for two dependent children and a 1,000 simoleon deduction for being a homeowner. He gets a refund of 1680. Oh, that's going to help this family so much. Um, I got to pull up my spreadsheet so I can put this into our taxes. This is curious round three, uh, 1680. We're taking out of the treasury. We now have a negative balance in the treasury, but that's okay. That's okay. We'll make it up. 
uh, I'm trying to make this a, I'm trying to format this, hold on. I don't know how to format anything. Dollar, I want a currency, thank you. I don't want to format anything in Google Sheets. All right, we got it. And so now I'm going to give him a refund of 1680 when we get back in there. 1680. Hmm, I maybe I should start writing it in the family description, their taxes. The stimulus check is coming to the curious family. He is a single dad. Yes, he is. Okay, so let's change his money. Um, since there's a whole bunch of curious households, I'm just going to use... Um, I'm going to use the money cheat. There we go. We're going to turn all menus off. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Um, here we go. Let's see here. Let's see what we've got going on. So 1692, that can actually help us out a lot with the house. Like maybe we can even move it out a bit. Let's see. Let's see if we can. Move it out like this. Put a new door in. Yes, that didn't cost very much at all. Okay, and... We should have done this before. And then maybe I can make like a little nursery over here. Let's make a little nursery. Why can't I, why can't it intersect wall? What is that? I don't understand what that means. Why can't it go there? Okay, I'm gonna do move objects on. Oh, I need to change the day to Friday? Okay. All right, I will. Don't let me forget. Um, what I wanted to do is make a little separate room for the child so that the child's crying doesn't wake everybody else up. So we'll do that. We've got... We've got... We've got something. And I want to center this door, actually. I think I'll use one of Honeywell's doors. Like that. It's just, they're living in a box now. Yeah, some windows would be nice. Some windows would be nice. I'm going to put the toy over here. Or maybe I can put it... No, I'm going to just have to put it here. Um, let's do the roof. And some windows. See, over here we made a two-story, and we may be able to do that here as well. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Eventually. But right now... Right now it's just gonna be a box. I'm sorry, he's living in a box. Let's reduce the angle to 35. Okay, and let's put some windows and some wallpaper on the outside. And this is enough to at least get them started. Uh, we'll put some paneling or something. That's fine. And <laughs> let's get some windows. So what are some cheap windows? Do, 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 do. Not too cheap. Not too cheap. Kind of cheap. This is a bathroom right here. Uh, thank you so much for the three months at Tier 1 Abbey 2019. So I'm not going to put a window there. Um, hold on. Let me go to my collections. Let me go to my bespoke stuff. Because that's what I want to use here. I want, two, I want a two-tile window. Perfect. There's going to be a window in the nursery like this. <laughs> That's it. That's the only window. I don't know what... You know what? We'll move the... the This over here. So it doesn't look so empty. Okay, and let's put a couple... Or let's put at least one window back here. If nothing else. 
Let's put at least one window back there. All right, we got two windows. Two windows in this house. That window's too expensive. Screw that. Let's put a cheap one. Let's put a cheap one on the back. Where's the cheap? Where's the window I'm looking for? There you are. There you are. That one's only 90. That's better. <laughs> I wish there was a two tile of that one. Oh, there is. There is. Okay, let's get rid of this. We don't need shutters, y'all. We're not that fancy. We need money more than we need shutters. Okay, perfect. <laughs> um. So yeah, Vidkind, he has all the children he's gonna have. So he he is um. He is a knowledge sim, and knowledge sims only have two children. He's got two daughters. So he does want to get married to, he does want to get married. He wants to get married and he, and so he's not going to meet aliens again. He's not going to meet aliens again because he'll come back pregnant. So we're not doing that. Um, but he wants to get married. He is friends with Holly Anderson. And you guys, I believe you guys told me that she was a knowledge sim also. So she could come and be like stepmother to the children. Um, and they're not going to have any more kids. That's what, that's the plan. That's the plan. All right. It it doesn't have to always count stepkids, but I'm going to. <laughs> All right. Oh, Friday. Yes, Friday. Thank you for reminding me. We're going to set it to Friday. Is this day setter? Fri set to Friday. Okay, we're going to sell that. And now we're ready to go. And it's 8.22 a.m., which means I think Dawn needs to be at school. We are going to have her walk to school. No, don't juggle. Don't juggle. Walk to school. So then it's just going to be Vidkin and the baby. Oh, no, she just spit up on him. <laughs> she just spit up on him. Great. Great. Um, all right. Let's get her inside. Let's get her inside to her nursery. Uh, put Daniela in the crib and you go take a shower. <laughs> Does he have to go to work today? No, he's off today. So this is perfect. I'm going to put the walls down. This is a sad little shack they live in. I realize that. <laughs> Friday, Friday. Is that how that song goes? I can't remember the melody. Romance Sims can have one. And the only exception is that, like, if they have twins, of course I'll let them keep the second baby. Um, but basically, it's pregnancies. How many pregnancies? Kind of. Because if they, if like, if they can only have two kids and they have twins, I'm not going to allow any more pregnancies. Um, if the romance sim has a baby, but they put it up for adoption, could they have another baby? I don't know. I got to think about that. I got to think about that. Maybe. Let me think on that one. Oh my God, Melba, get away from here. We don't need you, Melba. We don't need you. We don't need your services. Um, what I'm going to do, though, is once he finishes, we, we take care of his needs, we are going to call over Holly and flirt with her. Since he wants to get married and he wants to flirt, let's do it. Let's see if she's ready to be a stepmom to two alien babies. <laughs> she lives in Strange Town, after all. <laughs> Can you make the window disappear? Yeah, when you move a certain way, it disappears, but that's pretty much all you can do. No, the Smiths cannot have 10 kids. They're done. They have enough children. <laughs> They're done. Uh, okay, so let's call up Holly and invite her over. Goodbye, Melba. <laughs> How nice of you to invite me. I'll just gussy up and come right over. Well, you're welcome, Holly. I'm waiting for you, honey. Melba, get out of here. Just go dismiss her. Okay. Oh, we got child support. Yes. We got child support from the pollination technician. I am keeping it. All right. I'm keeping it. He's sending money down to earth. <laughs> I'm keeping that shit. Yeah, we need that money. Hello, Holly. No, no. Greet her. Greet Holly. Look what a lovely view he has up here. Look what a lovely view of Strange Town. I am going to get the... Uh, the terrain replacement for Strange Town so that it matches the backdrop. I just haven't done it yet because it'll look nicer. 
Um, oh, hello. Okay, they just started flirting on their own there. Um, let's do a little flirt. Uh, charm her. Hello. <laughs> Taking it hurt and ruined it for everybody. He wa they, she wants to play, so let's do a little sexy tickle. Little sexy tickle there. <laughs> Nervous ran away. Tell a joke and appreciate her. Okay, let's give her a back rub. And then let's tell her a joke, I guess. Entertain and tell joke. All right. All right. They're very good for each other, I think. Hey, there goes Kendall in her medieval gown, which has got to be extremely hot in this desert. <gasps> Vidkin, word around the streets is that you're not doing too great. Unpleasant rumors, what? He's not cheating. I wonder if it's because he has a, a little romance with Cersei, but obviously that doesn't matter. Oh, well. Oh, well. There's no lag in my stream. What are you talking about? Maybe you need to restart. <laughs> um, okay, so let's see. Tickle Holly. They're just going to play some baseball in the, in the street. We're going to tickle. Oh, that's not tickle. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to lock in skill because I want him to roll more once for Holly. And I don't give a damn about my bad reputation. If you're having lag, you need to refresh your, your page. Because my stream is... Oh, let's see. I did have some dropped frames, but it's doing fine now. Says it's good now. So maybe it did stutter for a second. Just try and refresh. Um, okay, let's see. Appreciate Holly and tell joke. Let's do another back rub. And I wonder if he can tell her a dirty joke now. Let's get her in the mood. Tell her a dirty joke. I only ask her on a date if he wants to. <laughs> entertain her. Okay, we're going to entertain her again. <laughs> it's uh, my stream says it's uh fine now no issues on my uh, connection issues on my end it's a very romantic view you can see the giant head over there tickle oh my god this is so annoying they get in these loops of tickle tell joke entertain <laughs> yes, the never-ending circle of appreciate and entertain, yeah. That's where we're at now. But since he does want to get married, um, I'm going to use that to do some romantic interactions. Because we have to do romantic interactions in order for them to fall in love. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Baby's crying. Baby needs us. Hold on. Sorry, Holly. I got to go take care of my child. Um, let's see. Let's... Does she need her diaper changed? I can't tell. Yes. Ch change her diaper, cuddle her, and let's get her a bottle. Oops. Feed bottle. We could get a bench for outside. Hello, Marion. What? What is your problem? Change the diaper. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I was just checking what my uh, stream quality says. It says it's good. There was a hydrate for you. Whoever redeemed hydrate and needs one. <laughs> And oh, thank you uh, so much. Did I say thank you for the three months at Tier 1 Abbey 2019? If I didn't, thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much for the three months at Tier 1, Millie Dragon. Thank you. Uh, okay, let's see. Put the baby back. <laughs> Put the baby up. We need a trash can. See, we don't have a trash can. And God, he just wants to appreciate her and tell her a dirty joke. He can propose to her though, but I don't know if she'll say yes right now. 
Because they're lifetime, they're not even in love yet. I think I should wait till they at least fall in love. <laughs> Stupid trapped butterflies, oh my God. We gotta release, I hate it when they do that. We need that countertop. She has two jars of them. We're gonna release both of them. I see the screenshot. Here, we'll take a screenshot of him giving her massage. <laughs> That's a cute screenshot. Let's see. We got to get um, Jill out of the, or Yeah, that's Jill, I think. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm trying to get the perfect angle. I want to get Vidkin's face in there. <laughs> there we go. I know the insects just die. I'm trying to get a good angle here. It's really hard to get. <laughs> there you go, Vidkin. The roof's not showing either. <laughs> we'll take it. No cars are coming because I don't have a car spotting thing on this, uh, on this lot, so. <laughs> Hello, Kimmy. I'm doing great. I know I saw that other jar. I've already queued him up to go release it. Okay, she's maybe she's a nature sim because she's doing all kinds of nature activities here. No, Vidkin! What'd you just do? <sighs> Don't catch more. Hey Barb! What are you doing up here? I bet it was a tough walk up that up that hill in those high heels. She walked all the way up here in those heels. <laughs> oh, Holly's just helping herself to the turlet. She's just taking a dump. Okay, I think I finished my tea there. Barb has calves of steel. Oh, Dawn just got home. Okay. Hello. Um, I, I want to get back to these two, but now Dawn's here. Hello, Dawn. Meet your future mother. <laughs> Holly's going to be your new mom. Uh, let's check on Dawn. She wants to do her homework. She needs to have fun. And I forgot. Do we know what her hobby is? Let me see. Fitness. I don't think I rolled for her secondary hobby. So hold on. We got to roll for her secondary hobby. Uh, fitness. We have... Uh, five different hobbies that she could have. So let me go to random.org and roll. I rolled a two, which means her hobby is skating. Great. We have no skating rink here. <laughs> Damn it. All right, Dawn. Skating, of course. Now I gotta build another skating rink for Strange Town. <laughs> yeah, and she wants to skate. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know what to tell you. Do something else. <laughs> do something do something else for now. She's going to play in the bathtub. That's cool. She can skate down the hill. That looks dangerous. Okay, we'll have to deal with that later. <laughs> Cuz right now I want to focus on this. Um, let's, oh, make out. Let's make out. What, you don't want to make out, Vidkin? Jeez. There's also, I also need to download those skates, those shelves that have skates on them for the roller rink. Well, we could get, we can't, we don't really have room for a couch, but we could get a bench. Let's see, Why, where am I going? We could get a bench for outside. Um, we'll use, we'll get this simple patio seat. There, now they have a place to woohoo. <laughs> hey Caleb, welcome. Oh, yeah, I do need this skate anywhere mod. I do need that. Oh, let's go answer the phone. Oh, he's happy. He likes his new bench. And they, oh, they just became best friends, too. 
Um, we can have a prediction. I don't know what we'll have. We can have a prediction. Is Dawn available to talk? Yeah, she's available. We can have a prediction, I guess, for <laughs> if they get married, which seems like it's a pretty easy prediction. They're not going to have children uh, because they have all the kids they're going to have. So I don't know. What do you guys want to predict for? You can, there is a mod so you can skate anywhere. I need to get that mod. Uh, I really do because that would be very helpful for our Sims that have the skating hobby. Oh, she may refuse. That's true. She could refuse. Okay, let's do a prediction for if they get married. Prediction. Prediction time. Will Vidkind get married yes or no because like you said she could refuse and i'll give you guys two minutes to put in your predictions there you go um they will she will not get pregnant from woohoo because i will be putting her on birth control immediately now it's possible that birth control can fail although it's rare and if that happens i'll let my sims keep the baby because it's just you know it's an accident Um, but we have to limit the children. I cannot go on with just everybody having like six kids. It's just too much. I, I'm not sure what aspiration. I think she's a knowledge. No, she's not romance. Bye. What are you leaving for? Okay, fine. She left. Well, Vidkin needs to make some dinner anyway. Uh, he's going to make some sub sandwiches for him and Dawn to eat. You put all your points on yes. <laughs> she saw that bench and left. She was hungry. Oh, yeah. She probably was. She couldn't wait around for one second. Vicken was just about to make dinner. <laughs> she saw the inside of the shack. She was like, bye. No, she's already been in here and took a dump in the in the bath. She took a dump in that bathroom and then she made out with Vidkin. <laughs> so she can't hate it that much. <laughs> You don't think she'll be down for it? I hope she is. Because Vidkin really wants to get married. She will bring in some more money and another income. And she can be here to help uh, with the girls. Because Vidkin loves his daughter, but he needs help. Loves his daughters. <laughs> he put the bottle on. We don't have a trash can. Oh, 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 out here you mean. Oh, yeah, yeah, we do have a trash can out here. I see what you mean. He just put it down right beside it. Okay, hurry up and eat, Vidkin. Hurry up and eat. And dispose of that. Actually, eat another sandwich. One was not enough. Uh, I believe the kids do, yes, have the same father. No, 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 they don't. They don't. I don't think they do because I put in... I don't know. I don't think so. Where Where's my family tree at? Can I see in the family tree? Uh, pollination technician. No, they do not have the same father, but Dawn and Tycho do. But uh, Daniela has a different uh, parent. Pollination te technician 83. And Dawn's is pollination technician. That's it. The original, I guess. <laughs> yes, they're sibling cousins. What is wrong, Dawn? What is wrong? Uh, oh, she needs fun so badly. What is she going to do for fun? You know what? She likes fitness. So let's have her go jump rope. Go jump rope. And Dawn will grow up in just one day. Oh my god, she's going to be a teen, y'all. Oh, the baby's growing up. Oh crap, the baby's growing up. Oh my god, Daniela. Oh, she's so cute. Look at her. Oh my god, she's so cute. Look at that little face. Okay, let's wait till she is he's gonna put her down. He's gonna put her down. I forgot it was I didn't know she was aging up today. Um, let's go have a look at her. Daniela, let us see you. Oh my god, she's so cute, y'all. Look at that. 
Look at that face. Look at those little teethies. Oh, look at those little teeth. <laughs> so cute. And she's got alien eyes. I love it. I love it. Uh, okay. Wow, we gotta zoom back in because the camera goes all wonky when you do that. Hello, Tiffany Riley. <laughs> I think she's adorable. Um, so yeah, in one day, Dawn is gonna become a teenager. That's exciting. Oh, and now we get to look at uh, Daniela's personality, y'all. So she, um, she is a Capricorn, which I think is, I don't know, I'm gonna look, is fortune. She's gonna be a fortune sim. She doesn't wanna be poor like she was when she was a kid, when she grows up. Check out these stats. Max neat, max playful, max nice, and very shy and lazy. <laughs> Holy crap, that is some personality. <laughs> yeah, she grew up in this shack. And I don't think, we don't know what her hobby is yet. Um, she needs to go to the potty though. Let's have Vidkin put her on the potty. Thank you so much for the five month prime sub Dean's, Dean's amulet. Uh, we don't have a stereo for me to put it on pop music, but if we get one in the future, I will put it on pop music. <laughs> I am excited. Oh, there's Holly, look. She came back. Hey, what are you doing over here eating our sandwiches, Laszlo? Go back to your gigantic mansion over there. <laughs> And eat your own food. Uh, okay, we gotta go greet Holly. After he gets finished potty training uh, Daniela. Let's check in on Dawn. <sighs> she still needs a lot of fun. We have nothing here really for her to have fun with. Ah! Don't go, Holly! Don't go! Oh, she's leaving. It's too late. It's too late. We lost our opportunity. Laszlo's over here mooching at our subs. Can't you see we're poor over here? <coughs> okay, I see your meme time. We'll do that as soon as we get through this day. Uh, and let's get everybody to bed. Dawn, oh, she needs to have fun so badly. I don't know what to do. Can you jump on the bed? Yes, go jump on the bed. That'll give you some fun. No, it doesn't. It doesn't get, that doesn't get fun? What? Oh, yeah, it does. There it goes. Oh, yeah, red hands. Red hands. Yes, that did. Jumping on the bed didn't give as much fun as I think it should. Uh, let's go play. Crap. Yeah, let's play red hands with Uncle Laszlo. That's a great idea. Twitch is lagging today. I'm keeping an eye on my stream, uh, my stream quality, and it says it's good. So if it is lagging, it might be, it must be Twitch. <laughs> what's the what's the child doing just hanging out doing nothing you got you have a toy over here go play with your toy can she not play with it let's try turning it that way there you go and all right vidkin vidkin's doing okay let's put away these sandwiches and let's say goodbye to Laszlo. It's very nice of him to come over and play with Dawn. Uh, but they're not playing Red Hands, so stop it. She'll play Red Hands with Vidkin. Oh, they just became best friends. Goodbye, Laszlo. Thanks for coming over and eating our sandwiches and leaving. Well, let's play some Red Hands up in here. Oh, look, he was thinking about Holly. Oh, there's no light in there. You're absolutely right. Let's, we need to put a light. Uh, what's a cheap, cheap light we can put in there? A single light bulb. Nothing says wealthy like a single light bulb sticking out of the wall. <laughs> Uncle Lazlo was hungry. Okay, I'm gonna get her fun up and then we're gonna send them to bed then we'll do a meme. No, Dawn is, uh, I forgot what she is. She is a Sagittarius. So I think that's knowledge, knowledge. She's knowledge. Um, all right, what's up? What's up guys? 
And she also has max outgoing, active, and playful. She's extremely sloppy and a little bit on the grouchy side. <laughs> uh, all right, Vidkin, you need to go to bed. And you, no, actually, don't go to bed yet. We got to take care of the kid. Don't go to bed yet. Put the kid in the crib and then you go to bed. Then you go to bed right now. Everybody go to bed. It's bedtime. No, no, no. Shoot. I hate that when it happens. Uh, put Daniela in crib. Come on, guys. It's bedtime, kids. It's bedtime. Stop jumping on the bed. Sleep in pajamas. Sleep in pajamas. All right, now you go to sleep. Everybody go to sleep. Oh, boy. What a household, what a household. And see how we're not gonna make things worse on ourselves by adding more children to the mix? Yes, lesson learned, Cindy. <laughs> Thank you so much for the Prime Sub uh, Gaming Witchery. Thank you so much. And let's do, let me save and let's do a meme real quick. Let me see what we got here. What do we got here? Um, we'll go to sub memes, see what you guys gave me today. I'm gonna let my family sims have three babies or six if they get that lifetime one, but I am honestly gonna try to avoid that lifetime one. Um, <laughs> I've seen a bunch of these. I'm just scrolling. I'm just, oh, here's an egg. Here's an egg from Kira. You've been visited by the good sleep egg. You will be blessed with cozy, restful sleeps, but only if you comment, sleep tight, egger. <laughs> I gotta add that to the command. I gotta add sleep tight, egger to our egg command. <laughs> sleep tight, egger. <laughs> it, it does look scary and creepy. Yes, it does. It does. That's funny though. <laughs> Scary, creepy, and funny. Oh, what's this from Cersei? We'll dance for nuts. <laughs> like, is that a little bra? <laughs> is that a little bra on it? <laughs> we'll dance for nuts, y'all. Is that like, is that like a sculpture you can buy? Oh my God. <laughs> Oh jeez. I would if I saw that in a thrift store, I would have to buy that. I mean, I would have to buy that. I couldn't walk away. I couldn't I would haggle for that. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the tier 1 sub simster 20. Thank you so much. Imagine getting killed and stuffed and turned into that. Oh, here's another one from from Beaky. Nut hot Chinese takeaway. <laughs> hot nuts coming through. Hot nuts. <laughs> oh, I love all the eggs and nuts. It's hilarious. Thank you for those memes, guys. <laughs> you have nightmares about egg about uh uh egger egger. <laughs> Hot nuts really get me going. <laughs> okay, um, if you want to contribute uh, memes, you can put them in the Discord under the memes channel. And uh, I'm gonna, I need to check uh, the regular memes channel too. We'll do that next time we have a meme. All right, what's what's your deal, Daniela? Did you get enough sleep already? You, uh, okay, okay. I'm gonna have Vidkin wake up and come take you to the potty. All right, we're coming. I love sleep tight, Egger. <laughs> Thank you so much uh, for the prime sub, Miggy's Musing. Thank you. All right, we're gonna keep trying to potty train her. Potty training is usually the only skill that my, my toddlers end up learning. Good for you, Daniela. Do you need anything else? Let's get you a bottle. Let's get you a bottle so daddy can go back to sleep. I think he was already on his way. There you go. 
<laughs> There's an amazing Chinese restaurant near where you live called Wang Wang. <laughs> I love it. Yes, he wants to play catch with Dawn and tickle Dawn. Maybe they can spend some time together tomorrow. Uh, go back to sleep for now, Vidkit. I know you're hungry, but you, you got to get your sleep. Because he's got to go to work tomorrow at 9 a.m. And we're going to have to hire a nanny, which they can barely afford. But he's, he's got no options. He's got to hire a nanny until we can get Holly over here. Holly probably has a really good job, though. I hope she does. Uh, thank you so much for the four months at tier one, Zoozle93. And also, I got a save game, so we'll go ahead and save. Now I got my coffee now. I drank a cup of tea. Now I'm drinking coffee. I'm going to have to pee. There's a hydrate for you. A hydrate of coffee. Also take a drink of water. What's his zodiac sign? Um... I forgot. It's Scorpio. <laughs> Did you just get all excited that you get to make your bed, Vidkin? Here, go clean that up. Let's check in on Daniela. She's getting pretty tired and she also needs a bath. Let's just go ahead and put her in the crib and let's call uh, and hire a nanny. Maybe the nanny can bathe her today. <laughs> Thank you so much for the Prime Sub, Bella the Sphinx. Thank you so much. All right, Vacan, call up the nanny and hurry up about it. Dawn, uh, Dawn needs to get some breakfast. She'll have to eat a sub sandwich. I'm going to hire a nanny to track my schedule. Um, I'm playing a clean template of Str Strange Town, but I'm playing the one that's on Mod The Sims. Excuse me. I don't remember the name of the creator, but it's the one on Mod The Sims. Because I like that one because it has the townies in it. Um, track schedule. My other Strange Town, I, I didn't use a clean template and it was fine for me. You've peed like five times in the stream. <laughs> Usually afterwards, I have to go take a real big pee. <laughs> a big ass pee. Uh, okay, she's the nanny's going to come over. Who is that? Vicky Horvitz. Vicky Horvitz. <laughs> I should some combine save and hydrate. Save and sip. <laughs> I try not to have intermissions. Um, I have had to do it before, but I try not to. Thank you so much for the eight months at tier one, Raybell. Thank you so much. Okay, what are you doing, Vidkin? Are you getting ready for work? No, you're not. Go eat your leftovers. You got four minutes. You got four minutes. You better wolf this sandwich down, buddy. Eat it down. Okay, you got to go to work. You have no more time. Put, your, put the sandwich down. Uh, Dawn went off to school. She's doing okay, I guess. We really need some more fun activities here. Like a TV would be really nice. Oh, wait, did, you didn't go to school, Dawn? Wait a second. Oh, it's Saturday. <laughs> it's Saturday. That's why she didn't go to school. Jeez, okay. Um, all right, thank you so much for the three month prime sub, uh, Slimy Brain, and thank you for the three month prime sub, F Fiery Furule. Thank you very much. Okay, well, she's catching things. Let's have her jump rope since she likes uh, fitness. I like how the nanny's sitting outside on the bench. She's sitting outside on the bench watching Dawn play. That's so cute. And hopefully uh, Vidkin can spend some time with Dawn tonight when he gets home from work. We still need to work on that relationship with Holly. And little Daniela, she is asleep right now. Okay, all is good. All is well. Aw, thank you so much for the uh, cheer, pretty odd simmer. Thank you. And thank you for the two months prime sub, Connor03. Thank you. <laughs> you don't want the weekend to end. Well, I don't blame you. Uh, my this weekend for me is pretty much like any other weekday because I have to I'm gonna have to work all, all this weekend 
I am. I am. I got a lot of projects. I got. I got my fingers in a lot of pies this week. I got a lot of stuff I got to get finished this weekend. <laughs> Watch Holly bring in like twenty k simoleons. I really hope so. I really hope so. Okay. I. She needs to bring in some money with her. Oh, we're getting child support. We're getting our child support. That's helpful. So we've got eight hundred and eighty-two simoleons. Hey, what, get the kid out of the road. Get the kid out of the street. Nanny, I really wish the nanny would potty train, you know? Oh, I'm going to do it. And it's all stuff I love to do, too. I, I love to work. I am a workaholic. I get enjoyment. I get pleasure from working. So, it's it, I, like, I don't even like to take days off. I try to take days off, and I'm like, the whole time I'm just like, what am I doing? I could be working. What am I doing with my life? <laughs> so unless I'm doing something like outside of my house, I always end up working. Uh, Dawn ages up today. She's going to become a teenager today. And also I need to look at my spreadsheet and let's see here. I'll let you guys see it too. Um, who is going to be in her, who do we need to invite over for her to become friends with? Let's see. Gabby and Harper. We could definitely invite over Gabby and Harper, although they are, uh, they're cousins. I don't know how old Ishmael is. Adam and Ceres can come over. Um, Floyd, Judy and Jay. We have so many kids. We have so many kids. I don't know who to invite over. We'll just invite over as much as we can. We'll just go down the line. <laughs> I, I'm not a fortune sim. I'm not. I'm more of a pleasure sim. Um, I do things for pleasure, not for money. <laughs> Money's nice. I like money. Don't get me wrong. But it's not my primary motivation. <laughs> I don't know. I love little Adam Beaker. He's a, he's a little sweetheart. Oh, I got a beg for gift sub from Amanda Ferry, if anybody feels generous in the chat. And uh, would I rather drive across the bridge in Sims 3 Beta Pleasant View or the inability to delete Melba? If you're talking in real life, the inability to delete Melba, I'm not going off that crazy train. <laughs> Money does give lots of pleasure. That's true. Um, but I can have lots of pleasure without money. You know, you know, you, enough money to live and be comfortable. But I don't need to be filthy rich, you know. <laughs> Yet I hate playing pleasure sims, I know. I just had to actually make one of my sims a pleasure sim in Pleasant View. You're going to see in the next, bit, in the next episode uh, coming Monday. I like playing with family sims too. Uh, okay, Dawn is she? Dawn's a knowledge sim, y'all. She's gonna be a knowledge sim, and she's had enough fun for one day. So what, Nanny? What did you do? Oh crap! Okay, let's go clean this up. The kids playing in the turlet. Why is the nanny just standing there? The nanny's trying to cook. She was trying to cook something. Okay, yeah, clean that up. Um, let's go to the bathroom. You get out here. Oh my god. The nanny's got her a bottle. She doesn't even need a bottle. Uh, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Amanda Fairy Caden. Thank you so much. I got another hydrate. I know the toddler's stinky. I was hoping the nanny would bathe her. Um, if I had to live in any Sims 2 neighborhood in real life, which one would you choose and which Sim would I befriend? I would live in Pleasant View, and me and Cassandra would be best friends. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with this nanny. She's worthless. She just stands there and stares. <sighs> All right. Okay, whatever. Um, let's get let's get Dawn something to eat. She, there's one sandwich left. Dawn can eat. 
Nanny, what are you doing? Okay, well, at least you changed the diaper and, sh and cleaned up. At least you did that much. No, Daniela, no, don't play in the toilet. Go play with your toy. Go play with your toy, please. <laughs> you want to be friends with Don Lothario? I don't. <laughs> I know. I'd be friends with Cassandra. I might be friends with Mary Sue. If I was a teenager, I'd be friends with Lilith. But she's a bit young for me to be hanging out with. <laughs> I don't know why she's having a bath. The nanny just decided to take a bath. You want to be friends with Brandy and Dustin? <laughs> Yeah, she took a bath instead of bathing the, the nanny. All right, Dawn, if you want to play in the puddles, you know what? You can. Let's get her a birthday cake, too, while we're here and put it on the counter. Well, actually, I'm going to put it on the floor right now. So maybe the nanny will go and cook that, cook that food. If not, I'll move it up on the counter before we age her up. You'd be friends with Sandy Broody? I bet Sandy'd be fun to hang out with. Sandy'd be fun to go to the bar with. Okay, Vidkin is home. Thank you, Nanny. You can leave now. Uh, Vidkin, why don't you cook this, whatever this was? Aww. Actually, no, we don't have time for that. We don't have time for that. You gotta call and do the birthday party. Um, let's throw... Nope, nope. Throw party. Birthday party. This nanny is especially bad. <laughs> Bar hopping with good old fish lips. <laughs> okay, we're going to invite Holly, of course. Um, we'll invite um, La Uncle Laszlo. We'll invite Pascal and Tycho. And then who else should we invite? Um, let's see, wh who are the kids? Samuel? Or who are the teens? Who are the teens in our world? Uh, Mitchie is not a teen yet. Harper, I guess we'll invite Harper and Gabby and Crystal. Okay, good enough. Good enough. Most of the family. What, you don't like your cake, Dawn? Missing, some guests are not coming, but that's all right. Um, why don't you clean this up? Let's get this on the table, or on the counter. I'd be friends with Rip for sure, yeah. Yeah. Rip would be, he would be the kind of, kind of kid I'd be hanging out with if I were a teenager. <laughs> I would definitely want to be friends with the Smiths, because it would just be real interesting to have an alien as a friend. Oh, uh, look who came. So Laszlo came, Holly's here, Samuel and Tycho came, and Harper... Uh, she's got so many cousins. Well, let's... Oh, she's taking a bath. Let's let her finish taking a bath, and then we'll blow out the candles. You eating our chips? You eating our chips, Pascal? <laughs> You'd give Don Lothario a try and woohoo to see what all the hype's about. Oh my god, they just fell in love. <laughs> um, or she fell in love with him. He's not in love with her yet. He just wants to spend time with his daughter today, Holly. Come on, it's Dawn's day. It's Dawn's day. Let's have Dawn go blow out those candles. She's gonna, I can't wait to see her as a teen, y'all. Now she still had the, the original pollination technician as a parent, so she's got the tiny nose. <laughs> she's got the itty bitty tiny nose and the flat face. Kind of like her cousin Tycho, her cousin slash brother Tycho, because they have the same parents. So they look, they have the same face. We're not going to propose yet because he's not in love with her yet. I'm waiting for love on both sides, which they'll probably fall in love very soon, probably during this party. All right, Dawn, blow out your candles. <laughs> Thank you for the eight months at tier two, small cat woman. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Get out of here, Holly. What are you doing? Okay, here she... Holly, get out of the way. She's standing right in front. <laughs> she blocked everything. Oh, there she is. Kind of. Oh. 
I want to see my I want to see my sim. Damn it. Uh, okay, she is. Let me just double check this. Yeah, she's a knowledge. She's a knowledge sim, like her dad. She likes glasses and red hair, and she does not like logical sims. Screw that. She doesn't want a smart guy. She wants to be the smart one in the relationship. Or girl, she may be gay. We have to check. <laughs> and who? No, we're not. I don't know. Should we age up this kid? Because we need more teens, remember? We're going to age up this kid. We got plenty of kids. We don't have hardly any teens. Okay, we're going to age him up. I, I mean, Coder. Coder. I don't know how to say his name. <laughs> okay, hold up. I want to see Don. Okay, he aged up, so we have at least one teenager. Uh, come here, Don. Oh, we got to fix her hair. She's got the transparent hair issue going on. Oh, honey. Oh, Lordy B. Okay, hold on. I got to fix her hair. She's... I mean, she's something. She is something. Uh, let me get this. Let me fix her hair with the bat box. We're going to fix invisible sim. I think that's how you fix it. Yeah, that's how you fix it. Um, okay, and then we're going to get the sim blender. And I'm just going to put it outside out front. We're going to put it out front. And we're going to do her gender preference. Uh, so we're going to do traits. Dawn, Cur where are you, Dawn? Dawn Curious, gender preference. And we are going to randomize me. After she gets out of the bathroom, is she trying to use the bathroom? Oh, he's using the, oh, I did the wrong sim. That's okay. It's still going to, still going to do her. She's straight. She's straight. And she likes red hair. Oh, he wants to classic dance with Holly. Uh, I'm going to undo the homework one. And let's have a look at her clothes now. I don't have an ACR adjuster. That's true. We need to spawn one. Can I spawn one off of her? Yeah. Um, we'll change this to a... No, you know what? We'll change it to a rose bush and we'll put it outside. We'll put it outside here. There we go. Good, good call. Uh, yeah, her clothes. So this is what she looks like. She's not too bad. She's not too bad. She does have that tiny nose. She got that tiny smushed nose. Look at her. Look at her from the side, though. You know what? I don't know. They can't breathe with that nose. How can you breathe with that nose? I would really like to do plastic surgery on her and Tycho. Because I don't know. What are you doing, Tycho? What is that? What is that? Uh, because I don't I don't feel like they can breathe. Normally I would not. Just if it's just a feature, I like my Sims to look different. But they can't possibly breathe with that nose. She breathes with her skin. Uh, thank you so much for the six month prime sub laugh dream love 22. Okay, so you know what? They're for their for her teenage birthday. Vidkin is letting her get some plastic surgery <laughs> because I want her to be able to breathe. Um, so we're gonna go to Gussie up, and we're gonna go to plastic surgery. It is not genetic. It is not gonna be genetic. She does need to breathe, though, because she's half human. She's half human. She's getting a rhinoplasty for her birthday. <laughs> and we're going to pay for it, too. We're going to pay for it. We're leaving her eyes. We're leaving her big bug eyes. But we're going to change the nose. Uh, because look at that. There's no way she's getting air through those nostrils. Um, so I'll just give her the nose that I feel looks the least bad. Uh, 
with those cheeks. Like, I kind of want her nose to go... There, that one doesn't look too bad. Okay, well, maybe from the front it does. <laughs> you get to choose your own nose. You know what? We may just have to... We may have to customize the nose, all right? We're going to start with this nose. And I just kind of want to make it a little bit bigger. So it doesn't look so weird on her face. And... Let's make the tip come out a little bit more. I guess that's all right. <laughs> I guess that's all right. That one's pretty small. It's pretty small. I just wanted it to stick out enough to where she could get air in there. Um, okay, I think we're gonna I think I'm gonna do this. I think I'm gonna do this. Um, happy birthday, Dawn. That's what you get for your birthday. Oh, look, she loves it. She loves it. Look at that. <laughs> Thank you so much for the six months at tier one red light bulb. Thank you so much. Uh, <laughs> that is cute. I gotta take a, I gotta take a screenshot of that face. <laughs> <laughs> she still looks like that original pollination technician, but hey, she's got a nose she can breathe through, damn it. <laughs> it's so cute. Now her clothes. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna, we'll let her keep this jacket and shirt, but I think I'm gonna get her another pair of pants. She looks like, these pants and shoes make her look like she's from a Charles Dickens novel. <laughs> She looks like she just came from the workhouse. So <laughs> we're going to get her a different pair of pants. <laughs> no, the plastic surgery does not affect her genetics. You can make it genetic, but I'm not going to do that. Um, okay, so let's gussy her up. Um, and let's buy her some clothes. <laughs> Oliver Twist. <laughs> Fun on the top, workouts on the bottom. Uh, so we'll just get her a cute little pair of jeans with some uh, sneakers like that. I think that'll be fine. And we'll plan her out. Oh, there are she already. There were already some pants in there, but that's okay. We'll use these. These are cute. And that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. No, thank you. No, thank you. I'll pass. Um, now look at her. That's so cute. She's adorable. I love that little smile she does. Look at that little smile. <laughs> that is so freaking cute. I can't stand it. <laughs> she's adorable. Um, she's trying to talk to her Uncle Pascal, I think. <laughs> that look on her face. It's, a, it's so cute. Hey! Oh, I forgot these two hate each other. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, they're enemies, y'all. They're enemies. She kind of looks like a praying mantis. She kind of does. Okay, I agree with you. She kind of does. Cousin sibling rivalry. That's what we've got going on here. They hate each other. So you know what? I'm just going to have her tell Tycho to leave. She's going to be like, you need to get out of my... I don't want you at my birthday party. Why are you even here? And he's like, your dad invited me. God. Look, they're even wearing like jeans and black shirts. They're even wearing kind of the same thing. Okay, and okay, let's check in. She's so tired. Poor thing. Get out of here, Tycho. She told him to leave. Go answer the phone. And Daniela only has two days left. I don't know if we'll be here then or not. Is Vidkin available? No, he's in the bathtub. Call back later. Yeah, I think we will uh, be here when Daniela ages up. Let's check in on Daniela. Oh my god, she's exhausted. Uh, Vidkin, get out of the bathtub and go put Daniela in the crib. And then you need to... He wants he wants Dawn to get an A+, Dawn to get a scholarship, Dawn an overachiever. Wow, I think we know who his favorite child is. <laughs> And oh, it was one day for Daniela. Oh, I thought it said two days. So it's one day. That is that right? 
No, it's two days. It's two days. Two days for Daniela. Oh, and I need to reset uh, Dawn's age as well. Let's do that now. Aging, reset to max days, Dawn. Okay, perfect. Uh, I am gonna charge money for the surgery. I'm gonna charge 250 simoleons for that. Uh, so actually, I'm just gonna take that away right now so I don't forget. Since they don't have a computer, I'm just gonna do it like this. All menus on, we're gonna do money minus 250. Okay, daddy paid for your surgery. <laughs> and we're gonna do all menus off, all right. I know it's cheap, but I had to do cheap. She she got it done in she got it done in Mexico. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't want to try to want to charge them too much because they don't have much money to begin with. All menus cheat works fine. I just now used it. <laughs> I just used it. <laughs> it wasn't for a deviated septum, so insurance covered most of it. Yes. That's it. Thank you, Miss Atomic Cake. Perfect. Oh, for you? Oh, you have to... For the all menus cheat, you can't just type it in. You have to go adjust one of your game files. Oh, he just fell in love. Um, if you Google it, there's a tutorial on the Sims Wiki on how to do it. He fell in love. The time has come. Um, classic dance or get married? Okay, let's ask her. Let's propose. Let's propose. Engagement. No, don't clean up the plate. Come on now. Okay, enough of that. Enough of that. Here we go. Will you marry me, Holly? Oh, she's gonna say yes. She's gonna say yes. She said yes. She said yes. <laughs> They're in love. Come live in my shack, baby. All right, they're engaged. So we can have a wedding uh, next, maybe tomorrow. I don't want to do it tonight because today was today was Dawn's day and she's doing her homework. Damn it! She, you're too tired to do your homework, Dawn. You don't you don't have to do that. Go lay down. Hey, what's going on? Oh, okay. Uh, Pascal and Samuel are having a water balloon fight in the rain. That sounds like a fun thing to do. <laughs> the party's a good time. Uh, Dawn had to go to sleep. She couldn't stay awake anymore. Vidkin, why don't you come out here and classic dance with your lady? <laughs> dance classic. <laughs> yeah, the prediction is, is yes, they are getting married. But just in case something happens, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna end the prediction yet. I'm gonna wait till they actually get married. I'm waiting until they actually get married. Just, who knows? She might die or something. Of course he wants to have a freaking baby, but too bad, Vidkin. Because <laughs> you've had all the children you can have, all right? You've had two children, and you're not having any more. I'm ignoring it. <laughs> I mean, he could be left at the altar. So it could happen. Well, and we have to see. I know I would like for Holly to have her own baby, but. Oh. Oh, <gasps> what? What just happened? Dawn just turned gay in her sleep? <laughs> what the hell just happened? How did that happen? She came out. She came out. All right. <laughs> she changed her mind. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. She had some lesbian dreams. <laughs> the nose job. Oh my God. Okay. You know, if that's what she wants, I'm perfectly fine with that. Let me write that down. Uh, Dawn is a, we have a more, le more gay and lesbian Sims in Strange Town than like any other neighborhood. Uh, Samuel's gay. Dawn is a lesbian. We have Barb and Margaret. I think that's it. I think we have four. 
I think we have four so far. This is about the same as Pleasant View. <laughs> Yay for gay. Okay. I, that's weird that that happened because, I mean, I already randomized her. I have no idea. <laughs> you turned gay in your sleep, too. <laughs> Barb does have red hair. Oh my god. I hope Dawn doesn't get the hots for Barb. Because Barb's ha very happily married. <laughs> Dawn was straight. She just turned gay on us. Or she, she didn't turn gay. She must have been gay all the time and she just realized it. <laughs> I randomized Vidkin earlier and not her. I chose her name though. I use I used Vidkin, but I thought I chose her name. <laughs> I remember that I had Vidkin selected, but I swear I ch I clicked on her name. Oh, I chose randomize me. Oh, but I but I clicked through her name. Hold on. Hold on. I know I clicked her name. Or maybe I didn't. <laughs> I went to traits, Dawn, gender preference, randomize me. So I thought that would randomize Dawn. Yeah, I did click Dawn. So I don't know. That's weird. No, Vidkin's not gay. He's still straight. Um, I don't know. I don't know why it happened, but it happens. And we're going with it, y'all. We're going with it. <laughs> ACR had a quota to fill. Um, what just happened to Vidkin and where did Holly go? I don't know what's happening. Things are getting strange in Strange Town, y'all. <laughs> um, okay, so Vidkin, let's see. Let's send you inside and get, let's get you some cake. No, don't eat that. Let's get you some cake. Let's clean up after the party and let's get you to bed. And tomorrow, maybe we can have ourselves a wedding. A wedding. <laughs> he reset and Holly was like, bye. That's too weird for me. Okay, go to sleep. No, no, no. Okay, don't go to sleep. The baby just wake up, woke up. What does she need? She needs to go to the potty. Okay, Vidkin, before you go to bed, you got to take her to the potty. Potty train Daniela. Holly melted in the rain. <laughs> I don't know what happened and I don't care. We're going with it. We're going with it in my mind. Dawn just Dawn chose her gender preference and I'm letting her choose. <laughs> Holly melts like sugar in the rain. <laughs> She's so sweet. I like Holly. I've always liked Holly. She's a good townie. She's gonna make a good uh, companion for Vidkin. Okay, let's see. Does the baby need anything else? A bath, but she can wait on that. Go get some sleep. Also, I don't think I did auto lights on this. I'm excited to see how much money Holly's going to bring in and see what kind of job she has. Because uh, whenever Barb married Margaret, Margaret had like a ton of money and a really good job. She's like level nine or something of her career. She has that bad face template. That's all right. She's not having any kids anyway. <laughs> <laughs> She's not having any kids. Watch her bring in 200 simoleons. No! 200,000 simoleons! <laughs> I'll be happy with whatever she brings in. And if she has a job at all, it'll be helpful, you know. Do I dislike any of the townies? Not really. Uh, in Pleasant View, I'm not fond of Kennedy Cox because he's always picking fights with everybody. But besides that, no, not really. No, don't say that. She's not going to have a crush on her stepmom. No. <laughs> I 
Uh, we could do a prediction on if she brings in a lot of money, yeah. Um, but we'll have to wait. Yeah, let me save. I want to wait. We'll wait and do that right before so I can make sure that the everything's going to go smoothly with the wedding. <laughs> I love Tasha Go. Uh, you hate Goopy? I love Goopy. <laughs> I like Jan Teller, but I like them all. I even like Kennedy in his own way. <laughs> I like Dan Jan Tellerman. She's actually really pretty if you put some custom content on her. Okay, I'm going to speed this up. I love Goopy. I love Benjamin, too. Benjamin, he's one of my favorites. Um, I'm not really that familiar with any of the Bon Voyage townies, to be honest. Goopy's name is terrible. Yes, it is, but... He's the goopster. He's iconic. <laughs> Benjamin, long, long man. I like Ivy Co. Purr, too. All of the Ivy Co. Purrs. Okay, poor baby. Oh, my God. Vin can wake up and take care of your child. She's exhausted. She's dirty. She's hungry. <laughs> let's, first of all, let's get her a bottle. Let's get her a bottle. Uh, thank you so much for the 100 bits, Nate Mays. Thank you. Nut is the best townie. That's right. That's right, Justin. Nut is the best townie of all. He Nut just Nut just came on the scene and he stuck. <laughs> he stuck to the wall. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry for that. <laughs> Okay, wait. Oh, Dawn and Vidkin finally got to play catch this morning. How cute. All right, we have to... Uh, oh, we got to get this kid in bed. She's not going to get potty trained. Put Daniela in crib. <laughs> Eleganda. I need to make an Eleganda sound bite, damn it. Someday I swear I'm going to make new sound bites. It's going to happen. Uh, thank you so much for... Oh, not thank you. <laughs> Yes, thank you so much for the beg for gift sub, Laura. Okay, that's what I was gonna say. I gotta get, I gotta beg for gift sub from Laura. Okay, if anybody feels generous, generous. That's a sticky nut. Oh no, the baby passed out. No, get the baby in the, put the baby in the crib. Wake up, wake up. Daddy's coming. There you go. Um, okay, and now. Vidkin, you need to go to the bathroom. You need to get out of there. Actually, no, no, no. Let her go. Let her go. Yes, hold on. Uh, clean this up. And we're going to get Dawn to make some breakfast this morning. She's going to make some yogurt for everybody. Oh, thank you for cleaning that up, Vidkin. Never mind then. And, oh, do you have to go to work today? Yes, he does. He's got to go to work at 9 a.m. So we got to get him in the bathroom. <laughs> Yes, Nut Fuda. It's actually Canute. Canute. Canute Fuda. We just like to say Nut around here. Uh, thank you so much for gifting us up to Laura. Okay, Caden. Thank you. Uh, Vidkin, your carpool is here, buddy. You gotta go. You gotta get to work. We don't really need the nanny today since Dawn is home. Dawn can actually babysit. So I think we're gonna dismiss the nanny. Um, so we can save some money because this family is poor. So thank you, Nanny. Um, you can leave now. Dawn is going to babysit today. Okay, well, thank you for cleaning up before you go. That's nice. Goodbye. Thank you. Thank you for your service. And Dawn is going to do some chores here. She actually has to really pull her weight around the house now that she's getting older. She can help her dad out a lot more until Holly moves in. And then she can be a teenage girl again. But right now, she's got to do some sister momming. <laughs> I randomized Vidkin's gender preference. I did. Oh, <laughs> I believed Hendrick when he said that. But I really thought I, I clicked uh, her. Well, good thing he was still straight. <laughs> good thing he was still straight. And uh, that worked out really well for us, though, because Dawn actually chose on her own. She chose on her own. 
<laughs> I know if I accidentally made him gay. Oops. Oops, sorry, Holly. <laughs> okay, she's gonna clean up. Um, let's make these beds. And let's get another bowl of yogurt. Gotta gotta keep you gotta be fueled by yogurt today. Oh, I did accidentally make him gay. Oh crap. Hold on, let's fix this. I think you're right, Max. I think I did. <laughs> but how could I have made him gay if he's still in he's okay, let's just check. Let's just fix it. Let's just make sure. Uh traits. Vidkin. Okay, not traits. I thought it was under traits. Maybe I can't do it when he's not on the lot. I don't think I can do it when he's on the lot. No. No, I can't do it when he's not on the lot. When he gets home, remind me and we'll fix it. Jeez. Jeez Louise. I'm glad I had you guys watching me. Or I would have never realized I did that. <laughs> Let's see some yogurt. Um, I think I have to wait till he gets back on the lot because it wasn't letting me choose him. Yeah, I'm going to change him back. It, I wasn't supposed to do that. And he's already fallen in love with Holly, so he's straight. He could be bi, but he's not. <laughs> he's having some doubts. But, he, but after that, he fell in love with Holly, so... Oh, hello, AJ. What are you doing up here? This is a popular place to go walking in the neighborhood, I guess. Go walk up the big hill like I do every day. I feel like I'm walking up a hill, hill that's that steep. <laughs> okay, Don. Um, you're pretty much good to go. You want to talk about hobby. You want to be best friends with Harper, best friends with Pascal, and you want to go to college. Well... Let's look at her relationships. Does she know anybody she's not related to? <laughs> she knows Floyd, but he's still a child. And she knows Adam, but he's also still a child. David Gibson is a teen with red hair. David Gibson is a teen with red hair. Um, okay, let's call him up, talk to him. He looked like a teen anyway. Oh, that's right. I forgot she's gay. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Never mind. Thank you. As as I was sending her over here there, I was like, oh, yeah, she doesn't like guys. What am I doing? <laughs> uh, how do I determine the age of my Sims with my aging system? Well, if I create Sims, I just I don't. But like if you talk about the pre-maids, I just go on the Sims wiki and I look at how many days from the next lifespan they are and then i just i just sync that with my aging system if that makes sense like if it says they're 10 days from becoming an elder then that would make them 50 years old in my aging system so that's how i do it newspaper girl is gay and she already left damn it she already left okay we got to try and talk to her tomorrow when she comes by we got to try to talk to her Uh, we don't have a teen lot in uh, Strange Town. We need one. All we have is the bar down there, the dirty Melba. Okay, okay. The ch she's got to take care of her little sister anyway. Um, tomorrow morning we're gonna watch watch for Esther, so she can talk to Esther. Cause I there aren't any more teen females in town at all. Uh, okay. The mod action. She's gay. Him gay. Her gay. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, all right. The kid needs a bath. So, Dawn, why don't you come in and give your little sister a bath? Uh, bathe Daniela. She's she's such a good sister, helping her dad out while he goes to work. And we've got still two days until uh Daniela ages up. And we've got two days left in spring here. Um, well, just because they is, they don't have the same turn-ons doesn't mean she won't be attracted to her. The turn-ons are helpful, but the, they're not the end-all be-all. Like, if they have compatible signs, she'll still be attracted to her. 
They just won't probably won't have three bowls. A dinky and yun run down youth club for Strange Town. Well, I would love to. The only problem is we have a negative amount of money in the treasury. <laughs> Um, I need to figure out how, because, and I've already built a strip mall, a career services, and a bar. We might have to make the pool the teen hangout right now. We'll have to make the pool the teen hangout for the time being. A yun down roof club? <laughs> a yun down roof club. Or we could make like an old empty lot somewhere with like a bunch of broken bottles on it and an old beat up couch. <laughs> That's what we could do. We could actually, you know what? We could actually make a teen hangout. Because if we used a one by one lot, it has a negative 400. That's what we can do. Watch. Hold on. Let's save. I have, I have an idea. The teens in Strange Town are so desperate for some place to hang out that they hang out at some old, nasty old rundown lot, junkyard lot, small town vibes with a with one of those old dirty couches on it. Okay, hold on, we're gonna we're gonna do this right now. Olive's lot is still empty. It is eventually. I eventually I'm gonna make that into the town uh, cemetery. I need to make it into a. Uh, but it's too fancy right now. Like, it's too fancy for that. I need to... And I'm going to make it like a museum, too. But I don't want it to be the town hangout. I mean, the teen hangout. The teen hangout, especially because we have no money in the treasury right now, is going to going to be... Where's my... Where's my one tile lot? There it is. Uh, thank you so much for the 35 bits, Jaden Man. Thank you so much. Where are we going to put this? That's the question. Where are we going to put it? Way down here somewhere? <laughs> it needs to be kind of closer to town because how are teens going to get there, right? How are teens even going to get to it? Next to the motel, you think behind the motel. That's where it's going to be. It can't go right there. It's going to be behind the motel. And I'm just going to call it. Damn, this microphone is driving me crazy. Um, the junkyard. <laughs> We're going to call it the junkyard. And then we're going <laughs> to. See, it's negative 400. So we have 400 simoleons we can spend. 400. The junkie Melba. Behind the sign, exactly. <laughs> Thank you, little red party dress. Okay, we have 400 simoleons we can spend on this. Um, we're going to do one of these old couches. 165 for this old beat up couch that sits out here. <laughs> That's the make out couch. And we're gonna, it's the first thing people see, yes. I wish we could afford a, oh, that made it Z, oh no, okay. That didn't make it zero, negative 235. I wish we could afford a fence. Like a 40 bucks. Ugh, that only leaves us with a hundred. Okay, we're not gonna. There's just gonna be out here in the open field. <laughs> they need. I know they need like a uh, a grill or something. I don't think I have a bond, a fire pit or anything. There's a grill. <laughs> One tree. How much was that? 20 for what? No. Okay, no grill. Damn. Damn, that was expensive. Um. I 
I'm looking at my miscellaneous appliances. I don't know why all these cakes and stuff are in here. The junk car. I think that that's way too expensive. We can add more to this later once we collect some more tax money. But I'm just trying to figure out right now what we can put on it. Oh, you know what? This is not a community. We have we need to change this to a community lot. Um, okay, what's the cheats? Change lot zoning. Change lot zoning community. I think that's it. I think that's it. Let's go out and see if that changed it. Yeah, I guess we could go in dead a little bit. It's not one lakeside road. Local teen hangout. It's a local teen hangout. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna sell the uh we're gonna sell this. An anonymous donation. We're gonna sell this too. That it it didn't give us any money though. It didn't give us any money. I think we have to have we have to have a phone booth. Um Where the hell's the phone booth at? We have to have a phone booth and a trash can. At least. So yeah, strange. So that didn't cost anything. So we have the old couch. <laughs> Maybe we should do two old couches like this. Two old nasty couches out here. And then we need some way for them to eat. What do we have? Is there, there's not a fire pit, is there? That's Sims 3. The only thing we really have is a grill. Bonfire would be good. There's a bonfire thing from university. Well, where's it at? Because I don't remember ever seeing that. Where is it? Party? It's under party? Oh, there it is. Uh, oh, yeah, this is from Bon Voyage. This is from University. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, why not? Why not? Um, let's kind of move this over. Let's move it over here away from the other stuff. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Uh, what else should we put? Let's let's go ahead and do the do the uh, fence because I feel like this should be fenced in. What kind of fence should we use? We'll definitely do some terrain paint. Yeah, a stone. Uh... We can do an old. We can do concrete. We can do concrete. <laughs> it looks terrible. <laughs> this is what they do with Strange Town's tax money, yes. Oh, chain link. Chain link. Oh, I like that. Hold on. I got a chain link here. I think this is it. Yeah. <laughs> Chain link. We need to put some trees, too. We'll do that, and then let's put... I don't think I have a fence for this, which really sucks. 
I don't have a fence that matches this, but we'll just open it up in the front like that. Some old plants. Yeah, just some spots open. <laughs> yes. I like it. So it's like all kind of run down. They need music so they can dance. <laughs> and I'm gonna mo actually move this back back here. Perfect. And what else should we put, guys? Oh, I wish I had a porta potty. I wish I had a porta potty. <sighs> Can we just put like a stall out here? <laughs> I wish there was a pea bush. That's what we need is a pea bush. <sighs> Can we just put like a weird bathroom stall out here? <laughs> How's that? How's that? <laughs> there's a turlet out here. <laughs> I want to see if there's a pea bush conversion. Somebody let me know if there's a pea bush conversion and we'll check. We'll, uh, we will uh, change that. Or maybe we'll just make it a little, we'll just make it a little shack. Oh, out of bounds, damn it. Okay, we're just gonna do it with the fence around it then. <laughs> right now, that's all you've got. That's all they've got for a bathroom right now. Yeah, let's put some plants around it. Do, 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 do. Oops, hold on. Uh, let's put some cacti around it. Not that. <laughs> I need the grungy public toilet. Yes, I don't think I downloaded the grungy recolors, but I need those. We'll make it. We'll make it black. Um. Okay. Let's see. Oh, that's way too big. That's too big. That's doesn't look good. I wish this would go on quarter tile, but it won't. <laughs> there, it grows under the toilet stall. Okay, so when you go in there, <laughs> you have to battle the, the uh, plants. <laughs> it goes under there. <laughs> <laughs> you love this episode of MTV Cribs. <laughs> I wonder if I could put this back here. I could put these back against here. Um, okay, and then... So should we put a grill? Can they cook anything on the bonfire? I know I need some beer bottles and stuff like that. Grill. Here, we'll put a grill over here. And we'll put... Uh, yeah, we definitely need some lights. Let's see. We can put street lights. I don't like that one. Let's put this one. Let's turn it nighttime so we can see how it looks. <laughs> how about that? I don't know about the one in the back though. I think I'll just put two in the front. I'll just put two in the front. That way it's kind of dark back there in the back. Boombox, yeah. Oh, we could put some string lights in the back. That's a good idea. Maybe the kids put those up. Let's move these down.
There we go. Just a couple. Just a couple to kind of illuminate that area back there. You got nothing if you go to the turlet. If you go to the turlet, you better bring a flashlight. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I need some, uh, I don't have a cooler. I need a cooler. I need like some broken bottles. Thank you so much for the prime sub Drew plays the Sims. Um, let's do some terrain paint. Let me turn it back to daytime. Let's do some terrain paint. And then, oh, a boom box. We're going to do a boom box. And maybe a couple more plants. Let's make it look kind of, kind of dirty. Like that. <laughs> it looks, it's so gross. This is where the teens hang out, y'all. Oh, man. Uh, let's put a little table. A little outdoor table. And we can put the radio on that. We'll put a little boom box on that. Oops, no. Yeah. <laughs> There's the radio. We got a grill. We got couches. We got a bonfire, which I think I'm going to move slightly over here. Over here. Come here, come here. Okay, we got a bonfire. Maybe one, maybe over here one more. Okay, perfect. We got an old turlet stall. <laughs> a lawn flamingo. Yeah, that's a good idea. Couple of old lawn flamingos. Couple of lawn flamingos. <laughs> oh, this is awful. Are there some, is there a recolor with smashed windows? Oh yeah, perfect. Perfect, smashed windows. Oh, I didn't even know that was one. I didn't even know that was one. Yeah, smashed windows on the telephone booth. This is so good. Um, is there a breakdance rug with graffiti on it? I wonder if that, where would that be under? Would that be under here somewhere? Car restoration controller. Um, what is that? What is poised podium? Yeah, I think we should put the old car out there too. Oh, it's the statue. Oh, okay. I'm just looking. See what we've got here. Um... Hmm... 28,000? What is that? Oh, large ice skating rink. There's my freaking pulpit I've been looking everywhere for, damn it! I thought it wasn't working because I couldn't find it anywhere. <laughs> uh, okay. I don't see a freestyle rug. That's an exercise mat. Somebody tell me if I'm missing it. That's the plum bob of praise. Uh, it's on the other page. Rink, rink, rink. Spring. Bowling alley. Oh, breakdancer mat. Oh, it's so big, though. It's very large. It's like, I don't know, it's so big. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not going to use that. I'm not going to use that. It spawns an NPC. Yeah, I'm not going to use that. 
Okay, let's see. Where's the car? Let's see if we can work that in somehow. Is that under miscellaneous? I never can see it. Where are you, car? I know you're in here. I know you're in here. I can't see you. Car is going to be pretty big, but I, I want to see how big it's going to be. Where is it? Do you guys see it? I'm just going to go through everything here. I am, I'm under hobbies. I'm under all, everything in the hobby thing is here. It's, it's here somewhere, damn it. Yeah, the junk car. It's in the car section? I thought it was in the hobby section. I can't go to the car section. I thought it was in hobbies too. But I'm not seeing it in hobbies. Yeah, it's probably just for residential. I'll have to get like a, uh, I'll have to get a decorative version. I wonder if anybody's made a decorative version of the old junker. You know? Could do a decorative version. It's gonna be really big though. We might have to extend the lot a little bit. Okay, so we'll wait for that. Uh, we'll call it good for now. Like this is enough for our teens to hang out on. <laughs> yeah, it's not for community lots. Okay, let me uh, also put a couple more plants and then we'll call it good. We'll put some more, like let's put some grass and crap like that, like make weeds and stuff. <laughs> let's see. What do I have that looks like weeds? Maybe some um, prickly pear. Put some prickly pear around, around the front. Just growing a little bit, a little patch of prickly pear up there. Um, ACR and sim blender. I will. I can't put ACR. I can put a sim blender though. Let's do that. I'll, I'm going to look for some more uh, CC for this lot too. Like I really want broken bottles. <laughs> we'll put a sim blender, but let me change. I can't change it until somebody's here. So I'll just put it right there and then I'll, I'll end up changing the, the adjuster. Yeah, an old tire would be nice. Some old tires, some broken bottles, that kind of stuff. Uh, we, I'll end it, I'll add, I'll look for some stuff like that. These are all controllers. Do, do, do. But I think this will work. I think this will do it. Oh, that is, you can put the ACR adjuster. Um, but that's okay. I'll just spawn it when somebody gets here. Cause I, I, I want to put the old phone books for that. Um, I think we're going to leave it like this for now. And how much did it cost us? 5,000? Good lord! What the hell cost 5,000? Was it this thing? No. Was it the fence? Maybe it's the fence. How much does the fence cost? Yeah, the fence, it was a big expense. The fence was a big expense, but you know what? I don't care. We're leaving it. We're leaving it. I keep moving this like I'm not happy with where this is. That's going to have to work. <laughs> no, those are like 30 each. I checked. I checked. Oh, I want to do one more like right there. So it looks more... Yeah, I might just give this one to the town for free. <laughs> I might just do that. Okay, let's save. This is it. This is it. I don't think I want to put the juice keg out here for teens. Um, I'll think about it. All right, let's go back to the neighborhood. 
Five thousand for a junkyard. I think we're just gonna make this free. This is a freebie. This is a freebie for Strange Town. Um, okay, let's go back to our house, the curious house, and then once Vidkin gets home, Dawn is gonna head out to the teen hangout for her first time. <laughs> The people need a place to put their trash, yes. Um, right now, she's got to finish watching her sister. But then once her dad gets home, he gets home at 3 p.m. So today, we can send Dawn out to the teen hangout, and tomorrow we can have the wedding. <laughs> All right, did you bathe your sister? Okay, she's doing great. Um... I don't know. I don't know what to tell you to do. Whatever you want to do. Take a shower. Get ready. Get Start getting ready to go. Oh no, go release these stupid things. I know, strange town people are like, what? How did this get here? You can see it out there in the distance. <laughs> behind the old motel. Uh, we have two days left of this family, so we have this day and tomorrow. Oh, what? She didn't like, uh, whoever that was. Caitlin Goss, I think that was. <laughs> let's get something, let's serve some lunch. Go make some lunch meat sandwiches, too. Make yourself useful while we're, while we're waiting around. <laughs> Lady Kendall has arrived. She's everywhere. She's everywhere. I love Strange Town so much. Okay, good. She, I, I just saw you burp. Go put th these leftovers away. Clean this up. Use the bathroom. You can have some fun when you get to the teen hangout. Okay, Vidkin's home. Uh, he earned 242 simoleons, so that helped out with the family funds. He's going to take a shower, and we are going to send... Uh, Dawn... No, don't. You're, I know your dad wants to hang out with you, but you got to go be a teen. <laughs> so we're going to walk over. She's going to walk all the way down there. It's a long walk. It's a long walk all the way to the junkyard. Uh, but she doesn't care. She's a teen. I used to walk that far when I was a teen to go hang out with my friends. We're going to the junkyard. <laughs> oh, yeah, I do need to change his gender preference. Thank you for reminding me. We'll do that right now before she leaves. Vidkin curious, gender preference. Oh, he's still straight. Show preferences. Yeah, he's still straight. I guess all that canoodling with Holly <laughs> changed him. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello, Buck and Jenny. All right, here we go. <laughs> I'm so excited to hang out at the new lot. <laughs> Gay low means it's like two towards the opposite sex. It means a low number towards the opposite sex. Okay, here we are. No, you know, we got to make this a teen hangout immediately. Okay, let's um, adjust. Wait. Adjust. Visitor controller spawn adjuster. We are going to ban... No, we're not going to ban townies. This isn't Nutley. We're going to ban children. We're going to ban young adults. We're going to ban adults. And we're going to ban elders. Everything but teens. And that's really all we have to do. Sorry, Jill. You're too old to hang out here. You grew up. Get out. Get out. Hello. No tank. Sorry. You got to go too, buddy. Oh, she already kicked over. She already kicked that over. Uh, nope, Gary. You gotta go. You're not a teen. <laughs> go turn on the radio. Uh, Loki? Nope. Sorry. Get out. <laughs> Are any teens gonna come? Is she gonna be the only teen here? She's gonna dance a little. No, Johnny. You don't belong. Oh, and let's change this. Um, who's that? Oh, Cameron. Oh, Cameron. We do have a female teen. Um, let's greet her. 
Let's greet her. Um, okay, I don't think she liked Dawn. Alright, well, maybe they can be friends at least. Oh, Tycho's here. Oh, great. She's gonna end up getting in a fight with Tycho. Maybe Tycho can meet Cameron, though. Tycho, meet Cameron. Hello. Oh, look, it's, it's, what's his name? Let's, let's greet him. She can be friends with him, anyway. Um, uh-oh. That didn't go well. What? Why is everybody being mean to her? Did you see that? Cameron attacked her and this dude attacked her. Dude. Nobody likes Dawn. That's so freaking sad. Oh my god. Can you jump rope or something? Are these the only teens we have, y'all? Besides Esther, I don't think Esther will show up. And we forgot to look for Esther. Oh no, look! David Gibson! Okay, greet David. I mean, she can be friends with him once again. He was trying to steal that. He was trying to steal that. Greet David Gibson. Oh, Samuel's here. No, go greet David. There's no love interest for her here, but maybe she could make some friends with friends with somebody. Yeah, I think Cameron... I, I'm hoping maybe Cameron and Tycho will like each other. No, Tycho, no! And these two are waiting to poke her, too. Look at this. Be poked. Be poked. No, you leave Dawn alone, you bullies. You bunch of bullies. Get, aw get away from her! God. The only one being nice to her is David Gibson. Everybody's and she the, she's done nothing wrong, y'all. She's done nothing wrong. I was looking to make sure she didn't have like a uh, like two nice points, but she's got four. Okay, y'all, you got to stop bullying Dawn. Why is Tycho popular but Dawn's not? Huh? Is it because she got a nose job and everybody's jealous of her newfound beauty? <laughs> it is so re realistic. It is. It is. <laughs> They're jealous of her. It's got to be. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. You get out of here, Cameron. Nobody asked you, you bully. This is sad. This is real sad. She's not having any fun. You know what? Why don't you light? Come over here and light this fire. Get away from those jerks. Let's do something fun. <laughs> Oh, roast, let's roast a marshmallow. Get Just get away from them. David's the only one nice. And look, David thought she was hot. <laughs> Sorry, David. She doesn't like guys, but she'll be your friend. <laughs> Push her into the fire. <laughs> she's roasted a marshmallow. See, she's having a lot of fun by herself. She doesn't need you jerks. Okay. Every time they try to steal the uh, flamingo, it resets them for some reason. I guess because it's on a community lot. Oh, okay. Well, she went after that guy. You instigated that. Be greeted. See, she and Samuel get along too. Well, that's what you get, I mean. That's what you get for being a jerk. Oh. And like, he's going to cry after that. Okay, so she gets along with her, her cousin Samuel, and she also gets along with David Gibson, but Cameron over here is a big old bully. She is bullying Dawn. I think she's jealous of her. So sad. <laughs> it, this is very realistic for a group of teenagers, isn't it? They're already grouping up in their cliques. <laughs> The paper girl was gay. Yes, we are going to try to meet her tomorrow morning. Okay, you... You know what? You get away. You get out of here, Cameron. Just get out of here. Oh, look. S uh, Samuel's tickling her. <laughs> Hello. Uh, 
I don't know. These are, I think these, I think this is it as far as teens go. Who is that? Oh, the unsavory charlatan. Y'all, I think I want to ban the unsavory charlatan because, um, I don't want him hassling my teens. Uh-oh. They're about to get in a fight over here. No, 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 no. Ban charlatan. Get out of here. No, don't mug it, Samuel. Oh, Jesus. Oh, is she going to cry in the corner? Nope, she's going to attack Cameron. <laughs> she's taking up for herself. <laughs> Let's get rid of this. Oh, boy. Did he just try to flirt with Cameron? This dude just tried to flirt with Cameron and she was like, uh-uh. <laughs> now Dawn keeps attacking her. Oh, no, she's attacking her back. Oh, Samuel. Did you see Samuel just tell David to call him? Yeah. Man, I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> um... I'm just waiting on them to get in a fight. Why are you crying? You're the one who was a jerk to her first. Oh boy, let's roast another marshmallow before the fire dies out. <laughs> Can we give Cameron a bad nose job? Oh my God. I know if Tycho and Cameron get together. Oh, she's cooking hamburgers over here. How much hunger do you get from a marshmallow? N hardly any. Uh, but hey, here, go grab a hamburger that Cameron made. <laughs> they're just fighting because they're teenagers, I guess. Uh, where did Samuel go? Did he leave? I think Samuel went home, y'all. That's too bad. It's just Tycho Cameron. I mean, and the only person who's nice to Don, David Gibson. <laughs> they're teens. That's it. They're teens. Ground burgers. Yum. Yeah, I love this lot. This lot is perfect for teenagers. And the, yeah, there's not a lot to do, so they do have to talk to each other. And there's Samuel. He came back. Aww. Samuel and Tycho get along really well. Samuel's a sweetheart. He gets along with everybody. <laughs> he left and he came back. <laughs> I believe the bonfire will respawn when the lot respawns. I believe it will. Uh, yeah, they can have different last names in one house. Oh, you mean in the regular Sims game? In the irregular? In Sims 1? Is that what you're asking about? Um, I don't know if I, I, I don't know if I missed this, but thank you for the prime sub Drew plays the Sims. I don't remember if I said so. But if I didn't, thank you. Samuel, she just farted on camera. Did you guys see that? <laughs> she just crop dusted her. <laughs> oh, good one, Don. Good one. Cameron's like, I can't have that. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Hey, is it perfect that they're listening to country music? Is that perfect? <laughs> have that, you big bully. Oh my god. I built this lot just now. We just built this lot. <laughs> Um, it was very, it's a very simple lot. It doesn't have much going on. <laughs> Maybe I should have saved it to share. I can clean it and say, and share it if you guys like it. Although it wasn't very difficult. Look, the freaking leader of the pack is here. All right, I think it's time for Dawn to go home. <laughs> She's had enough. She's had enough. She's leaving. Uh, let's see. We're going to walk home. <laughs> Teen Fight Club. That's what it turned into. <laughs> it does have some custom content, though. The, the plants and the fence. But that's okay. I'll just include that. I'll include the fence, at least. <laughs> it's the junkyard. 
There's a junkyard stuff pack with 11 usable items, including old car and the Sims resource. Ooh, okay, I'll check that out too. Maybe I'll use that uh, for the one I share. <laughs> okay, Dawn was gone for eight hours, so we're back to the house now. Now, I don't want to have the wedding without Dawn being here, so I think we'll use this time for Vidkin to maybe work on his skill points. God, he ha never has any wants for Daniela. Like, Dawn is obviously his favorite daughter. I don't know what to think about that, Vidkin. Um, you have another child, Vidkin, you know. Uh, let's take her to the potty. And look, she's doing really bad. Let's take her to the potty. Let's take her to the potty. <laughs> I pay for a uh, sub to the Sims resource so I don't have to deal with the ads because there's some really good stuff on there. I know, poor baby. Danielle is much cuter. I know she is. She actually is. But Vidkin just loved his first daughter so much. He loves Daniela too. And, you know, maybe he'll have more wants for her as she gets older. Right now, she's just a toddler. The Sims resource has a lot of good grungy CC. It, it does, yeah. That might be where I got that fence from. Uh, bye, Kira. Have a good weekend. Yes. Birthday and wedding coming up. Uh, yeah, tomorrow. And tomorrow will be our last day. We're going to have an age up in our wedding. We got 30 minutes left in the stream. I think we can do it. <laughs> I think we can do it. We're going to have to speed up through this day. And you're just going to sit there and daydream? No, work on your skill. Okay, he need. what kind of skill does he need? Cleaning and cooking. Okay, I think we're going to have to buy a bookshelf. I think we're going to have to buy a bookshelf so he can work on his cleaning and cooking skills. So let's get, we'll just get this cheap, cheap one right here. That doesn't look right. Is that how it's supposed to go? Yeah, I guess so. All right, let's go um, study your cleaning. He just wants to gain any old, any old skill. Aw, oh, thank you so much, Z, 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 Zim, 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 Zim. <laughs> thank you for your compliment. Uh, all right, he's going to come outside and sit on the bench. It's a lovely day to come sit outside in the fresh air and read. And he's going to try to get this uh, cleaning skill point. Daniela will grow up in just one day. Once he gets this cleaning skill point, he's got to take her to the bed. Hello, Kristen. Okay, come on. I don't want to interrupt him yet. She's good. She is. Did she pass out? She's gonna pass out. Okay, go put her in the crib immediately. <laughs> I didn't realize it was gonna take him so so long. Poor thing. She's about to pass out. Get that baby. Oh no! Get that baby in the crib. Wake up. <laughs> put Daniela in crib. Okay, there we go. Now, let's go to the bathroom. Um, let's grab him a leftover sandwich that Dawn made earlier. Level six cleaning or a cooking skill point? Well, he needs a cooking skill point more, so I'm going to lock that in. She She's doing fine. The child's doing fine. Uh, she's going to sleep for a bit. Vid can, can wake up in the night and take her to the potty again. Now, it's... Yeah, he's going to eat. He's going to grab a, bowl, a bite to eat, and then he's going to get some sleep. He's got to get ready for the big day tomorrow. He's getting married to Holly. I'm very excited about this wedding. Uh, I think Vidkin and Holly are going to be very happy together. And Holly's going to be here to help with the girls. <laughs> I'm not. Danielle's staying. Danielle's staying. Um, and... Dawn is going to do her homework. It is too late to do your homework. Don't worry about that. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. All right. Everybody's going to sleep. Let's save. I know. I'm so excited to see her job and her skills and her money. I'm most excited about her money because they are living in poverty over here. <laughs> now, they've made it. They do have 758 simoleons, but still, I mean, that's not enough to do hardly anything. Oh, let's check on the baby. Oh, God, we got to get her to the... If we get her to the potty right now, we can probably potty train her. 
Get up, Vidkin. And I'm sure that Dawn is sick of sharing a room with her dad. <laughs> she is a teenage girl and I'm sure she wants her privacy. We probably could put a little door right here and give her a little room. Um, I might try that. <gasps> oh my God, those teens were bullying Dawn because she's poor. <gasps> that is it. That's what I'm going with in my mind. They were bullying her because she's poor. Those freaking jerks. He fears getting bit. No, he fears getting left at the altar. He fears getting left at the altar. Those are some jerks. See, she's going to show them all. Dawn's see now Dawn's got a soft spot in my heart because I got bullied when I was a kid for being poor. So I feel for Dawn and she now she's my favorite. <laughs> she's extremely poor will she get rich someday well she's a knowledge sim so i don't know uh it's possible she'll definitely not be as poor as the, as her family was when she was growing up she'll definitely have more money than this okay so did she get potty trains not yet uh let's get her a bottle uh get bottle for daniela and then you can go you can go back to sleep if you can. Does he have to go to work today? Yes. Okay, so we'll have to wait till after 3 p.m. to do the wedding. Um, I'm just going to do this so he'll go back to sleep. It's annoying to me when they... I need a mod where they can sleep anytime. I know that. I know there is a mod like that. I just don't, I have never downloaded it. Uh, Dawn is, does not have a secondary aspiration, no. I don't get, I ever give my teen secondary aspiration. Aww. That sucks, a red light bulb. When I was, I remember when I was in kindergarten, my grandma made me wear boys shoes to school. <laughs> like, we had this, this is so weird. But my grandma bought like this big box of shoes from a garage sale. So it was just like, a box of random kids shoes there was like 20 pairs in there and for some reason there were no like girl shoes in there so she made me wear like these hideous blue sneakers and i hated them and i was so upset and the kids made fun of me and i started crying in my in my kindergarten class and I remember my teacher asking me what's wrong and i was saying i don't i had to wear boy shoes to school <laughs> It was so awful. Now I'm just like, I wouldn't give a shit about that. But you know, when you're a kid, you don't know. People make fun of you. It hurts your feelings. Um, okay, Dawn, what are we going to do? Let's get you some breakfast. <laughs> I can laugh at it now. Yeah, I can laugh at it now because it just seems so ridiculous. But at the time, you know, it meant a lot. Daniela, you need to go to sleep. Oh my God. Somebody needs to put you in the in bed. I know she's in the road. I know she is. <laughs> Nobody watches these kids. Uh, here, I'm going to, I'm going to do this because he should have been full on sleep. We're going to wake him up. He's going to put Daniela, go get your child out of the road. Oh my God. Is that Esther? Who the hell are you? You're not Esther. Who is this? Where's Esther? Where's Esther, you imposter? <laughs> Who is this? Um, okay, well, I guess let's go greet her. <laughs> I'm gonna check her anyway. Hello. Um, I don't think so, but let's check her. Traits. Marie, gender preference. No. She strongly prefers males. <laughs> um, okay, carry on, Marie. Never mind. There's two paper girls in Strange Town, and apparently Esther does not service this location. <laughs> Poor Dawn, I know. That's very disappointing for her. 
Uh, okay, why don't you... Well, let's check on Vidkin first since he's got to go to work. He's got to go to work in 30 minutes. Go use the bathroom. The nanny's here. Yeah, I guess we do need the nanny today. Everybody just get... Okay, he's got to go to work now. And she's got to go to school. Everybody go. Go, go, go. It's time to go. Go, go, go. Okay, what? Get out. Can we... Excuse me. Oh, my God. There. Go to school. Elegonda. Elegonda. Okay, now it's time for you to go. You go to work. Nanny, get out of my way. God. Jeez. You couldn't make Marie straighter if you tried. No, you couldn't. <laughs> I know the bus just flew off. Because this tiny little lot, it can't even leave. They just fly away. <laughs> okay, Nanny, you better take care of this child, please. Hello, Lola. She needs to be potty trained. Was somebody saying the nannies will potty train if you get the more expensive po uh, potty? Let's see if it works. I almost never get the expensive potty. Where the heck is it? Let's try it. And maybe it's only some nannies. It's really hard to get a good nanny. Most of the time you have a bad nanny. Bad, bad nanny. Strange Town has four pre-made newspaper delivery teens? What? Four? Why do we need that many newspaper teens when there's so few ha homes? I've had the butler do it too. Maybe it's just the butler that does it. Oh, Holly just came walking by. Holly, don't just walk by this child. This is going to be your daughter now. You're just going to leave her out here on the street? <laughs> oh. They really need the teens to have jobs. I guess so. <laughs> I don't remember ever seeing a nanny potty train. That doesn't mean they don't do it, but I don't remember it. Esther, Marie, Paul, and Peyton. Wow. Danielle is trying to hitchhike out of here. <laughs> okay. This nanny is the awful. This is Vicky Hor Horvitz is really bad. Poor Daniela. She needs to go to the potty. She's going to end up going in her diaper because nobody's going to be here to take her. Oh, Dawn's grades are improving. Uh, Dawn brought Samuel home from school. Aww. <laughs> She's going to be really close to her uh, cousin there. <laughs> Vicky, horrible witch. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can we take her to the potty. Yes, I think we can make it, and this will do it. She'll be potty trained if we can get her. Come on. Potty train your potty train your sister. Hurry. Hurry. Oh my god, we can't get her. Get her. Hurry. Hurry. We're gonna have a double party tonight. We're gonna have a birthday party slash wedding. Did that work? What just happened? Potty train her. I don't know why she just got off. I know, I know. Is it because Dawn needs fun too much? She can't do it? Oh, jeez. Okay, okay. Why don't you go out here? Just go out here. Go out here and jump rope with your cousin. Uh, here, medium, medium jump roping. She needs fun too much, so I'm just going to have her go out here and jump rope. She's barely getting any fun. Screw that. Let's play red hands. Here, play red hands with your cousin. Play red hands. <laughs> Come on, Samuel. Watch out for the baby with your jump rope. Let's play red hands. Come on. No. <gasps> no. There we go. 
Uh, I don't think she has a bad reputation. Her influence lever is com common cajoler. She's a lifetime loser. Oh my god. Oh, we. You know what? We also have lifetime aspiration benefits to give her. Let's give her the knowledge ones. That might help some. Don't give a damn about my bad reputation. Okay, Vidkin's home. Vidkin, come potty train Daniela. Hurry. Hurry. We can still make it. We can still potty train her and she can grow up well. She can grow up well. It's going to happen. Yes. Yes. Okay, so let's do this first. Um, let's age her up first. And then, and she wants to age up well. She's gonna grow. She's gonna grow up well. We're gonna age her up first, and then we're gonna throw the wedding party, and we'll celebrate it all at once. Um, so let's buy a cake for her, and let's bring Daniela to cake. And actually, first let's invite Holly over because I want Holly to be part of this. Come on, Holly. Because she's going to be their mother, basically, now. Let's invite her over. Okay, she's coming right over. And then let's bring Daniela to Kate. Man, Samuel loves to tickle Dawn. <laughs> That's a little strange. Okay, we're going to bring her to the cake. We're going to age her up. I got to remember to reset her to max days. She's going to be adorable, I think. I think she's going to be really cute. Because she got my uh, replacement pollination technician jeans. <laughs> no sexy tickle. They're, t they're cousins. And Samuel's gay. <laughs> or they're both gay. I forgot. <laughs> uh, yeah, they're just playing around. They're just playing around. Here she goes. Look at those. She's got the Jimmy legs. Aww. Be still so I can see you. Be still so I can see you. She's got a cute hairstyle. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Look at that face. She's adorable. Oh, she's precious. Um, I'd like to see what her everyday clothes are looking like. She needs a shower anyway, so let's have her go take a shower. After she gets... Oh, she's going to do that first. Who's calling? Who's calling? Go answer the phone. Uh, is Holly here? She is. Let's greet Holly. Okay. Um, is Vidkin available? No, he's about to get married. Stop calling here. Danielle is so cute, y'all. <laughs> okay, we'll end on a meme. I want to get this wedding done. Oh. Okay, and Dawn, uh, Dawn really needs to go to the bathroom. But she can't right now. Here, clean this up. Oh, now you can. And let's see what your clothes look like. I think she's wearing a cute little dress. Oh, look what she's wearing. It's so cute. It's so cute. <laughs> It's like a little bohemian dress. That's adorable. She is, she is too cute. <laughs> okay, so now we got to get ready for the wedding. Um, let's see. We're going to buy a wedding arch. I don't know where the heck we're going to put a freaking wedding arch. Um, party. Can we? We can't even afford a wedding arch. Oh, my God. What can we sell? We'll sell the bookshelf for now because we could buy another one when she when she uh, moves in. <laughs> We're gonna put it right here. There, because I don't think we can put. Can we put it outside? I mean, we can. <laughs> They're gonna get married. Okay. Sorry, Samuel. Sorry, Samuel. We gotta move you over here. Um, they can get married right here. We'll move this over here. None of this matters. We just have to have room for them to get married. 
a sandy front yard wedding. That's exactly what's gonna happen. So let's throw uh, the wedding party. We're gonna throw party, wedding party. After he gets done greeting his love, Holly Anderson. <laughs> the trash. I don't want them to get married in front of the trash. <laughs> Okay, uh, we're gonna invite, not Cersei, we're gonna invite Laszlo, Pascal, and Tycho. Actually, we're not gonna invite Tycho. Tycho, you gotta stay home, cause you're a jerk, you're being a jerk. Okay, stop being a jerk. Uh, Jenny Smith, who else should we invite? Um, well, we'll invite uh, Crystal and Gabby and Harper. We'll invite all the family except for Tycho. Tycho, you have to stay home. <laughs> you have to stay home. Um, yeah, we can... Well, that's all we can invite. So that's fine. The wedding's on. The guests are on their way. I'm gonna wait till 6 o'clock passes so then I can remember to reset uh, Daniela's age. Oh man, Dawn's about to pee her pants. Okay, six o'clock is here. The guests are here. Let's uh, go to aging. Reset to max days. Daniela. Oh no, I, it's not six o'clock yet. Crap, I gotta do it again. I gotta do it again. Uh, aging, reset to max days. Daniela. There we go. Um, everybody's in their fancy clothes here. Crystal's pregnant. She's pregnant. Okay, so let's do, let me do the prediction, because they're obviously about to get married. Unless something just crazy happens. Uh, wow, 89% of you guys said yes. <laughs> you were correct, Vidkin will get married. Now, let's do a prediction. If... Holly will bring... Will Holly bring... How, what should I do? More than 2,000 simoleons to the household. All right, here, no, here's what I'll do. How much will Holly bring? How much will Holly bring? Less than five, less than 2,000? Or more than 2,000? Okay, I'm gonna give you one minute to put in your prediction. What should be 150? You got one minute. She's not gonna leave him at the altar. Um, okay. And then we're gonna start getting them ready. Poor Dawn, she's about to pee her pants. Who is in the bathroom? Vidkin, I know you want to get clean for your wedding day. He actually does need to get clean for his wedding day. Let's give it a minute. Okay, get out. Dawn's got to use the bathroom immediately. Go, Dawn, go. Vidkin, get out. Vidkin, get out. <laughs> this is so bad. Get out of here. He's like, I just want some cake. Dawn, go to the bathroom. Go, hurry! <laughs> I hope she brings a lot so that they can get their own place because this is, it's craziness in here. Like, they they can't even have a double bed right now. Um, okay, so we've got a few more seconds of predictions and then we're going to get married. We're going to get hitched. <laughs> I don't know how the party's going here. Nobody, nobody's talking to the... Daniela's asleep on the bench outside. Poor thing. <sighs> okay, predictions are in. Let's get married. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Holly and Vidkin getting joined at last. Okay, there's Holly changing into her wedding dress. It's a nighttime wedding. Vidkin changing into his fancy formal clothes. He's got a white suit on. She needs to bring some money. 
<laughs> She's getting married after snacking on those Cheetos. Clean off your Cheeto fingers. Oh, here we go. Aww. No, no, I can't see. Oh, there it goes. No! Oh, she's not leaving him. She's staying with him. Aww. Okay, and we're going to change it to his last name. 14,000! 14,000! Oh my god, yes! Yes! You know what we can do with 14,000 freaking simoleons, y'all? We can do a lot with that. We can do a lot with that. That's going to build them a whole ass house. All right. <laughs> Let's do predictions. Yes. More than 2,069% of you guys said more than 2,000. So we're going to uh, give you your points now. Complete prediction. <laughs> now we've got to, Look, he wants to have a baby. I'm sorry. We can't. She does too. What is she? Knowledge? Crap. I'm going to let them have one more baby. Damn it! <laughs> I'm going to let them do it. Because she has no children. It's weird with the step key. She, has, she gets to have one. Okay? They're going to have one. Especially now that they can afford it. Um, Since she has no kids of her own. That is true. Um, Vidkin's going to go over. But I'm going to let them have one child. Okay. I hope they have a boy. I kind of hope they have a boy. Um, I'm going to make an exception for this. I can make an exception to my own rules when I feel like it. For my old rules, they would have had three. So I don't feel bad. <laughs> okay, 14K. I just sold the arch right there. Uh, 14k. Oh, we need to check her uh, job. Oh! She's level 9 in the freaking science career. <laughs> she's, level, she's a level 9 scientist. Oh, yeah. Those kids won't be making fun of Dawn for being poor anymore, will they? <laughs> okay, but you know what? We have to give her a degree because she could not have gotten that high without a degree. Um, so let's buy a sim blender. Let's give her a degree real quick. So we're going to upgrade sim pre-uni and we're going to give her a degree in biology. <laughs> yeah, she can pull some strengths for him. Exactly, because he is only level three in science. <laughs> yeah. She wants, the first thing she wants to do is hire a maid. She's like, I'm not cleaning the shack. <laughs> okay, we will hire a maid. We will hire a maid. But they get to move out of the tiny house. They're going to move out of the curious compound. Like, I'm just, like, this lot is not big enough for, like, a long term for them to have their family on. Um, so when we play, play them next, I guess, because we obviously don't have time to do it today, uh, we will be building them a new house. And yay! And oh, let me look at her personality. So she's very neat, just like Vidkin. And um, she's very shy. She's so sweet. And her hobby is science as well. Wow. Man, they have so much in common. They are perfect for each other. They, they're both scientists. They both love science. They're both knowledge sims. Oh yeah, I'll check her inventory. Good, good, good idea. Oh my God, she's got stuff. Holy moly! She's got the expensive freaking fountain! She just brought another 5,800! Holy crap! Um, she's got the sphere? She's got the sphere. <laughs> We're keeping the sphere, though. And um, she's got all this other stuff. We're going to keep this. But we are going to sell this stupid thing. Because that's another 5000 we can put towards the new home. Yeah. 21 grand, y'all. This is the best marriage ever. Um, so, yeah. Next, next Saturday, we are going to be building this family a new house. And because she brought so much money... 
<laughs> yes, yes. Because she brought so much money, we are gonna let her and Vid can have one additional child. So she can have one child of her own. Um, yeah, and I would love to see their genetics too. <laughs> She's bringing home the bacon. Okay, so I'm gonna save right here. I know we're in the middle of a wedding, um, but it's almost time to end the stream. I'm gonna save right here so we can do a meme. Watch them have twins. They probably will. Well, at least they can afford it. At least they can afford it. So yeah, we're gonna build them a house. They're gonna need a one, two, three, at least a three bedroom. They're gonna need at least a three bedroom, two bath. That's what we're gonna try to build for them. Uh, Holly's a hoarder, a little bit, a little bit. <laughs> a red haired boy, that's what we need. We need a red haired little boy. Uh, okay, so let me check. Did I save? I don't know. I'm saving again. Can never save too much. I definitely saved that time. So let me check the memes. I'm going to check the regular meme channel and see what you guys got for me. <laughs> got for me down there. <laughs> uh, so many good ones. I'm just... Oh, good lord. If they're videos, guys, I'm not going to show them. They have to be like actual just images. <laughs> this is funny. I saw this one the other day. This one is from PT9 is a DILF. <laughs> That's their name. The awkward run when a car lets you cross the street. Yep. You kind of, you don't want to full out run, but you kind of feel like you have to show the driver that you're moving quickly and you respect their time. So you just kind of run. <laughs> relatable, relatable. Uh, okay, let's poop on that. And then... I saw that one before. I still don't get it. <laughs> Round meal, macaroni, and beef? What? What is that? <laughs> it's a round meal. It's... How to do it. Boil in bag. Open and enjoy. I think this is what they serve at IHOP if you... If you uh, if you order pasta at IHOP, this is what you get. <laughs> serves three men. <laughs> it serves three whole men. <laughs> it serves three men, y'all. Just in case you didn't know. I'll, it even says round meal down here. Wow. Wow. That's a winner. It's a classic round meal. No questions. <laughs> Um, okay, we'll do one more. <laughs> what? I left a phone here earlier. Okay, what kind of phone? A cell phone. <laughs> oh, God. It's fake? The round meal is fake? Don't crush my dreams like that, Kristen. <laughs> Thank you for the beams, guys. Thank you for the beams. Um, I love them. I love them. So I'm, well, you know what? We've got two minutes. So let's play out the last two minutes in the, in the game. I don't know. I think the round meal is true. I think that's a real thing. I've seen some weird stuff. They're playing football. That's what they're doing on their wedding. Why don't you guys get in here and talk to your guests? Um, chat, chat. I feel bad for uh, Daniela, who's sleeping out here on a bench. <laughs> like, we're going to quit before um, they have to go to bed, because I don't want to even spend any more money on this shack. <laughs> it did go by so fast. Did Tycho drop by? What? Samuel, were you just taking a bath in here? This is not your house, dude. <laughs> I can, I, I'm really excited to build their house. I really am. And we're going to do that next time. And then after that, we will be playing uh, Laszlo and Crystal. And so we're going to have a, a baby born. Uh, Crystal's going to have her baby. And that's going to be their final child. <laughs> so they have twins, Gabby and Harper. And then whatever kid this is, this is their last child together. <laughs> I know, I'm so happy they're not poor anymore, too. We should have known that Holly was going to save the day. 
She's a rich scientist <laughs> who Vid can convince to fall in love. Are you stinky, Dawn? You stinky. She's stinky and she needs fun. Okay, this is just, all right, we're gonna end it. We're gonna end it, we're gonna save. Wow, what a stream. Everything re went really well and it was so much fun getting Vidkin married and then having our junkyard lot down here. I'm gonna look for some more custom content for that too. Hopefully I can do that before next week's stream. Uh, Babby is not formed this time, but probably next round. I'm gonna let them have another child because this, this is really the end of their round. But I can't leave them here in the shack. We've got to build a new house for them to live in while we move on to the other families. <laughs> That's true. She must have sold her all. She must have sold her. Maybe she lived in a condo in Sim City or something. <laughs> she sold everything off. Or did she live in one of the apartments? I don't. I don't remember. I don't know. All I know is that she brought all her money, and I'm happy. <laughs> Well, guys, thank you so much for joining me for another Strange Town Saturday. This was a super fun one. I had a lot of fun. And uh, let me see what I got. So Monday, we're going to come back with Nutley. And then Wednesday stream, we're going to start playing The Sims 3. And I've almost got my, my world set up to play. Um, I just have two more female Sims to create, which I'll do by Wednesday. And I've already got my world ready. Um, I'm going to surprise you guys. I'm going to surprise you guys with what world I'm going to use. And then... Um, also, I hope to get a, a blog post out about that today, hopefully. Hopefully, I can get that done today. Um, and I got more pleasant, more uh, episodes of Pleasant View coming for you on Monday. I got so much stuff coming, y'all. I got so much stuff. <laughs> and also, I'm going to be doing a video on The Sims 4 likes and dislikes, but I got to play with them first before I can make a video about it. So I'm hoping to do that tomorrow and then get that out maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, all right, so thanks again for joining me. I really appreciate it. Thank you for all the subs and bits and thank you for just hanging out um, don't forget to join our discord and I hope you all have a great weekend. I will see you all very soon. Bye guys. <laughs>